Right, good evening folks. How are we all doing? Well, this has been something and a half, hasn't it, really? Uh, this whole thing with uh, Chantel and the cats is just an absolute nightmare, isn't it? Um, if ever if ever we sort of kind of knew she was a psychopath, this is probably proof of it. Um, so, yeah, let's jump straight in. Uh, not been about much. Um, just been busy. Busy and tired, tired and busy. So, um, yeah, let's get into this. Now, let's start off with when you're getting rid of your cats, you'd imagine it's quite an upsetting time. Not for foodie, though. Full makeup on, eye makeup done to the hilt, got a lipstick on there. Uh, looks like she's been crying all night, right? People's circumstances do change. They do. Um, but this is this is something else. This really is something else. And she's going to regret this. Um, she best not be coming back with her tail between her fat legs um, and then getting more cats when this all goes horribly wrong because she's been told. Uh, she's been told. Hi, cool gamer. Good evening. Hi, Andrea. How are you? So, right, here she goes. Can you imagine? She's getting rid of her. She's getting rid of Sam in a couple of hours. And um, to me, I flicked through this. I only finished work at like six o'clock. I ended up working a little bit later, but I'm working from home, so it makes no odds. I've just been catching catching up. How long has she known this man? Uh, well, she, may, she knew him on Tinder, international Tinder, I think it was, or Plenty of Fish, one or the other, for about two weeks. She flew to Kuwait, got married maybe probably not um and she stayed there for about three months uh, one of the cats she's had 19 years the other one about six years and she used these cats as branding for her channel um i don't know people on the internet they don't forgive stuff like this um but look how happy she is i've flicked through this um done dinner and all the rest of it sort of so i haven't watched all of this it would be impossible um I flicked through this. She couldn't look more chuffed with herself if she tried. I honestly think, oh, cat's way longer. Yeah, she's known the guy like three months um, and she's had the cats absolutely years. Yeah, love me, love my animals. <laughs> you know, not in foodie's case. I mean, my ex-husband, he tried to make out I had a cat. Um, I've still got cats. Um, and he he was like, oh, I've got asthma, I'm allergic to cats. And I was like, oh, well, never mind, not getting rid of Stimpy. And, um, oh, look, he was fine. <laughs> I mean, all right, the molting season, he was dosed up with the antihistamines. But I'd had that cat ages. There's no way I was getting rid of her. <laughs> no chance at all. It was love me, love my cat. Um, but, hey, foodie isn't like that, is she? Uh but look how happy she is. Anyone else would be absolutely, you'd look like awful because even if your circumstances made you give up an animal, there's people that have babies and the babies have horrific allergies to animals and you have to rehome them. All sorts of things can happen. Uh, but this, but you'd be in tears, wouldn't you? You'd be in tears. Um. Yes, I have seen the red picture. Yeah, um, who knows? It could be old, it could be current. Who cares? It's just an absolute mess, isn't it? And as far as Anna, like spilling the tea, I mean, he hasn't really, has he? There isn't really much tea to spill, is there, that isn't already spilt? We don't think she's legally married. It's all a big old sham. She did pay him 10 grand for sure. So, I mean, there's that. No, it, it, most people wouldn't. And I mean, this isn't like she's a love-struck teenager. Um, she's nearly 40 years old. It's, it's a picture of what looks like Salah's, her bloke's eyebrow, snoozed up in bed next to another girl. Um, but it could be it could be an old picture, you know. Either, either way, taking pictures of someone you're in bed with without their consent is a bit sick, isn't it, Salah? Because no one else took that picture. Well, you'd want to be, wouldn't you? <laughs> it's Tori. I know, you're hooked on the soap opera. Is it my fault? I can't remember with you, Tori. Is it my fault you're in the foodie verse? <laughs> a lot of the chat, it's my fault. I blame COVID. 
yeah, it's so rare, so rare. Like, you know, I, I can't imagine. I can't, uh, I mean, pet passports are a thing. You know, I, I took my cat overseas, the, the the one that I had for ages and ages, the one that lived in her 20s. Um, she had a pet passport. Yeah, we travelled. So did the cat. She was fine. Um, all right, she didn't in her last years. She didn't travel in her last years, but she did well into her late teens. So, you know, there's that. Uh, oh, it is my fault. Oh, God, sorry. <laughs> right, let's get to this. Otherwise, we'll be here all night. I'm still actually in the dining room, which is the makeshift office again, since I'm working from home. So um, I've been planted here all day. So, right, okay, let's go. Hello, hello. What is she wearing? <laughs> sorry, that's to get rid of any lipstick on my teeth. The... Flopera, how did I know you would be the first one? And how did I know this would be your first question? I did see a bit how, of that this morning. I yeah, I did. I did see I did see a bit of that this morning. Hiya, Charlie's mom. <laughs> how are you doing? You are right back for this mess? Oh, dear. We are warriors in this nastiness. I, 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 I've had enough of her. Um, but but this, this, you couldn't, couldn't kind of... Um, can kind of let go by um really so um oh god yeah I did I when I was getting well sort of getting ready for work this morning I mean I'm working from home so there wasn't a lot of getting ready uh they were getting up and having a coffee basically and then walking downstairs um yeah, I did watch some of that, and it was just like she put a whole bag of cheese on one pizza it's just like unbelievable unbelievable two different colored bags of shit oh she's and that dip she was mulching about hi sunshine how are you right come on then <laughs> look at what she's I wearing need to have my coffee now checks and stripes what does she look like <laughs> hold on Stare at some junk while I prepare my stuff. Why, thank you kindly. Um, what is this? This new thing of turning us round so that we can see all the mess on her counter. I can't believe she's still got the box for the world's coldest water bottle. I mean, isn't that round Nadsy's house? Why has she still got the box or has she bought another one? Trying to make out she's got sponsorship again. Hmm, I wonder. Love oh, lovely. Singing away, getting rid of my cat in a couple of hours. Yeah, I, I mean, you'd be in bits, wouldn't you? And no, no matter what the circumstance of you having to get rid of an animal. I mean, Sam, she's had six years. You'd be in absolute bits. Oh, no, not foodie. Sing, sing, sing a happy tune. Sing a happy tune. Sing, sing, sing. Oh, this. Could she not have done that before she started the stream? She is vile. Um, uh, this is, let's turn that sound off, I can't stand that running water noise, it's like being around Nadsy's house. Um, it, this is absolutely vile, I'll be surprised if she comes back from this one. Disgraceful. No, I, you'd just be in bits, wouldn't you? you you'd you have been up all night cuddling your animals, telling them you're sorry, um, and you'd be broken, knowing that this is going to happen in just a couple of hours. I mean, I she's a psychopath. Right, she stopped with a tap note. Still, still singing. Who knows? God, let's not have that visual. Mhm. Mm 
Well, the thing is, she will. If she goes back to QA, if she goes back to QA, her views will go down. Since she's been back in Canada, they've been up again. But she goes and sits in sits in that little hovel of a tomb of a prison cell of an apartment doing the same rubbish she done last time. There's no longevity there. Yeah, people might watch for a month or so. We've already put up with three months and we're looking forward to her coming home. Not to this, though. No one saw this. Um well, we did because she was going to get rid of the cats when she was with low life nads. But like after another month of it, um, of, a, of being in QA in that little room, watching her stuff her face, eating rice and chicken on a sofa. I mean, there's no longevity to that. She won't get her feeders back. That ship sailed slowly. Mm-hmm. No, she did. She don't. She's just incapable of it. Yep. She will. It's boring. She's boring. She's getting rid of. I mean, if you think about it, all of the side characters that she's needed to support her channel. We've we got Pete's. We've got the cats. We've had Nads. Um, we've had side character Roman L. Roman. Um. She's she's got rid of the cat, which was her branding. You know, she had them on her on, on her intros for her pre-recorded mukbangs. Like she's used them cats for her channel. She's used them as content fillers, and now she's throwing them in the bin. So all goes wrong in Q8. No one really likes salaries as boring as they come. Um, and what? No side characters. No Pete's. No cats. I mean. I mean, Pete's, but quality content. <laughs> oh, God. But she couldn't be happier. All dolled, all dolled up, all makeup up, eye makeup on. I mean, I'd look like Alice Cooper if I had eye makeup on and I knew I was getting rid of my pets in a couple of hours. One's ready. Oh, Peggy, sweet treats. Hello, hello. Ugh. I can see my pin. There we go. Tuck it under the chin. I honestly think she gets off on upsetting her viewers. I, th I think she knows exactly what she's doing. Um, and she actually gets off on it. Ten when you 000. can see your pin, tuck it under the chin. Mm, what did Sally see? Hmm. The promise of a visa to Canada, and when that wasn't real, then um, ten thousand dollars, I think, which actually isn't that much in Q80 money, is it? What two and a half, two and a half thousand Q80? Okay. Oh my God, you guys are crazy, crazy for feeling. So lonely. It's exactly how it is. Do I suck or what? <laughs> What's shaking? Hello, bacon. <gasps> Hello, bacon is good. All right. Look how Remember happy this? she well, is. I found out I had Look how damn happy she is. Is she on substances? This this is just unreal. Too. So I'm gonna use it. Moving will really reveal all the stuff you thought you never had. And then uh -huh. put two in there. I'm putting two and two together. <clears throat> All right, what, you want me to address the elephant in the room besides me? Oh, no. Sorry! Oh, I'm a cow! <laughs> no, I'm not zooted. I'm just crazy. This is the thing. Whoa. If it weren't for the glassy eyes, you'd never be able to tell. Actually, I'm not sure what the shade is called, Papa Smurf. I have to check. I think it's called I'm Fabulous. I can't stand her. This has to be the worst of her that we've ever seen. You've got to be kidding me. The hell is wrong with her? Sorry. It's happened now. She is a complete psycho and she's actually getting off at the fact that her viewers and her chat are upset about the cats and she's not. What the heck? What? I just wait. No, the Beezer is not gone yet. 
All right. I spent a lot of time researching actually what I would need to do to bring Sam with me. What? A you had three months in Kuwait to work out what you'd need to do to bring Sam with you. Yeah, you need a vet check. They need chipping. They need rabies vaccines. That's what you need to take a pet to the Middle East. That's it. That's what you need to take a pet out of the Middle East. That's what you need to take a pet from the UK over to Spain. It's the same thing. Rabies, tilt tests. You have the rabies. Then you have the tilt test. If the tilt test comes back all right, then that's it. You're good to go. And if it hasn't, then you have to have another shot of the rabies and be up to date with the normal ones. But, <laughs> you know, your cats wouldn't be up to date with any of them. But that's what it takes. Um, depending what country you come from, don't know what it is for Canada. UK is not a rabies country. If you're not a rabies country, you're pretty much good to go. Um, if you are in a rabies country, it takes about three months, I think. Three to six months, depending on what country, because there's like green, amber and red for rabies. Um, so that's how it works. So it takes anything between six weeks and six months, depending on where you are in the world. There you go. But she's just looked it up the day before she's getting rid of Sam. Nice one. Assuming he would not be terrified as it is. Hi, Sriracha. Hi, everybody, by the way. Sorry. Oh, Nikki. Welcome to Very Important Beaches where you sit bees. So, he would need a passport. Oh, he would need like, a whole bunch of documents. <laughs> All this stuff that I didn't think of. Hi, baby. Oh, lovely. Um, so, yeah, anyway, this is better. This is done out of pure love for my cats, and that's the last I'm going to say about it. Just shut up. No, it isn't. It's pure selfishness. And actually, to be honest, long term, it is the best thing for them. You're vile to them cats. If we knew that they were actually going to somewhere nice, um, family, friends, as you say, and not the animal shelter. Because while Sam's got a good chance of getting rehomed, maybe Jane, not so much. Yes, I'm sad, obviously. I'm sad. <laughs> I'm going to miss him, and I probably won't realize how much until after, but I'm going to mm -hmm. try to accept the fact that he's going to have She's a nice life. Sam. Hi, Freya. She couldn't take Sam. Take her too long. Um, she can't get, she couldn't get, couldn't get that um, pet parcel done in time now. Not for the time scale that she's talking about, which is like literally the end of the month, so it wouldn't happen. Oh, I wouldn't even be surprised if she's just ditching the cats gonna get back with nads and stays in canada she's just she just lies Miriam, thank you <laughs> sorry <clears throat> in that um mm. he's gonna be better off without me okay. oh he will facts true story that he will be better off without you as long as he's safe no i can't take them mm -hmm. chubby youth I wouldn't even... I know it's... How can she even look at him and do that without bursting into tears? Six years you've had that cat? What the hell is wrong with her? Mind you, I haven't said that. She wasn't really any different with her grandma, was she? So, but we have to move on. Like, he's just going to have a better life, okay? So, leaked pics, like... Oh. Number one... Mm -hmm. There's no proof that Sala. His face is not showing. But I will say, okay, even. I think this, look at her. This, she's not normally like this. She's usually insanely jealous about everything. Uh, I think this picture is a setup for more views for everyone all involved. Um, be it Sala, be it Allah, be it her. This is just more controversy. Um, she wouldn't be like this normally. She's an insanely jealous person. She would be bouncing off of the walls. I mean, don't forget, Nads, after two weeks of going out with him, dared not to answer her calls for a couple of hours, and she went full-on bunny boiler. I mean, no, I'm not buying this. I think this is all a big old ruse. More views, more money, shits and jokes all round. Let's assume it is, Salah. Mm -hmm. Do you guys not think of the concept um, 
do you not realize? Okay, say it's him. Mm-hmm. He has a past. Like, he has, he's a man, mm-hmm. okay? So a man would have... Well, yeah, that's what you'd have thought. That's what you'd have thought. I mean, could came in, maybe it is his wife. I mean, would that not get him in trouble over there? Being in bed with a woman outside of marriage and having it all plastered over the internet? Something stinks here. Something really stinks with all of them. And I'm putting Ale in there as well now. Um, he didn't spill any tea. He demanded 1,000 subs. Then he wanted 5,000 subs to spill the tea. Yeah, he spilled a bit of tea, but he didn't really, did he? Said he broke, she broke a sofa. She broke some furniture because she's fat. The rest we knew anyway. And now this eh, stinks. Past relationships with people. Yes, it happens. <laughs> like, Shut do up, you not remember you. the pictures of Tony? Me and Tony I posted? Same thing. Same red light, even. Oh, no. Oh, no. She's loving this. See, she's loving this. Controversy. She's loving it. No, no, not buying it. She'd be insanely jealous. She'd be doing a nut. It was only the other week that he didn't answer for a, an hour or so, and she was calling him a coward and a hog. Didn't he? No. This stinks. That woman was skinny. Well, why do you think he's not with her today, Flopera? The woman was skinny. And he's with a fat bitch today. So what does that tell you? Oh, no. He really needed 10 grand. Oh, no. (laughs) He thought he was going to get a YouTube millions. Oh, no. Bloody hell, he's earned that money, isn't he? Crikey. Guess who won? Me. Won? Ha. Wow. What is wrong with you? <laughs> you not <nut> job. <laughs> Hiya, love. How are you doing? Yeah, a little bit better. I get my blood test back tomorrow. I'm not looking forward to it. I'm trying not to think about it. Um, got a, got a phone call booked in for tomorrow afternoon. So ugh. work keep asking me when I'm coming back. And they're like, you back on Wednesday? And I'm like, I don't know. It depends what they say. It's... Uh, yeah, it's just, but, well, eh, it is what it is, isn't it? Worst thing happening in the world. Could be worse, could be horrible, like Chantel. <sighs> but thank you, sweetheart. So nobody has a red light in their room? I know! <laughs> Let's see the date. Oh, God. They're probably way old. Way old. They prove, they're, the only thing that they prove is that you people are insanely thirsty. And salty. And you're just going to have to stay mad because... What is wrong with her? You're getting rid of your cat in a couple of hours. Like, look how pleased you are that the internet is talking about your bloke being with another woman. It's a great big old setup for more views and money. This is absolutely disgusting. Ugh. That's it. <laughs> Uh, Spoiler alert, Chantel gets back there when Salas decked the whole place out with red lights. (laughs) Oh dear. Anyways. Yada yada yada. All that proves is that this, this person who did the leaking is a big piece of crap and I mean who cares? Uh, I mean, really, Mm -hmm. like, nobody cares. Nobody cares what somebody does two friggin' years ago. (laughs) I mean, there was a load of chat that you had a Polish wife, wasn't there, at the beginning? Um, I don't know. (laughs) No, but she's too pleased about it. She's gloating, like, oh, I've won this catch of a man. Yeah, yeah, we're all really jealous of you, Chantel. Oh, dear. Am I gonna care? Hi, Mishimu. Oh God, babe. Like seriously, are you gonna like be mad at me for any past relationships I had? No. Uh, thanks, bad baby. Hi, everybody. Mm. Are you telling me to drink? Mm. He might not be mad at you of past relationships, but I mean, you know, his family probably are absolutely appalled. Um. There's one thing 
coming from a Western background, there's another thing with the OnlyFans and all the rest of it. I mean, mm. that is nice. Do you still record? I know. <laughs> this is Mary Poppins. They can't tell you. <laughs> Before he was dead. Um, <laughs> what are you talking? <laughs> I've done it. Look at look at that picture of the the red leg picture I posted before. I don't know. Bragging oh. rights. No. What? Yeah, who says it's even solid? Well, who does that? I mean, kid maybe kids do that. But I mean what grown adult does that if they're in bed with someone when someone is fast asleep, takes a damn picture of them? That's just not right. Men don't do that. Adult women don't do that. It's a private life because it's called private. Look at her. Oh, well, I done it, didn't I? Well, yeah. Sick, aren't you? Hello. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Fact. <laughs> Technically, yeah. What's your lip color? Um, I don't know. I left it upstairs, so you're never going to find out. But... <laughs> Oh, God. All right. Why is she yelling? Baby, sorry. Oops. Beats. Baby, I don't have my ring, but I have my infinity bracelet to prove my love. <laughs> Looks like it came out of a, a kid's chicken egg machine. I mean, g g prove your love. Shut up. This is beyond weird. You're getting rid of your cats in a couple of hours. <laughs> yeah, so... Couldn't be more smug if she tried. You can't see the faces. What is this? This is. She said, even if Salah, it was in the past. Yeah, like, even if it was. Because I'm pointing out every single possible angle here. Who cares? Trixie. If it was, you'd be doing your nut. Oh, sure. Now they're going to find something like like that. I posted a picture Ugh. of a member of Tony and I. Ugh. She just sniffed her finger. Oh, you dirty mare. Watch her. She sniffs her finger. Oh, sure. Now they're going to find something like like that. I posted a picture Ugh. of a member of Tony and I. like on. What is on her wiping hand that she just smelled? Uh. <laughs> Who does that? Who picks a glass up and clearly can smell something on their own hand that they have to give it a double sniff? I mean, that is rank. There is something wrong with you, woman. The, my community post, everyone's like, that's so creepy. How do you know that person didn't have permission to do it? Thanks for the super chat. How do you know they did is more the point. <laughs> I just saw the pic on Reddit. There's a, like an inch of the man shown. Who looks like every other Arab man in the world. Right. Gingivitis bees. No. Uh, fat Judy. Salah has never seen, looked at, breathed near, touched another woman before Chantel. Yeah. Right. Hmm. Anyway, ah. I'm assuming. Hang on one second. My computer. What's that doing? Session has now exceeded its time limit. Log off will start in two minutes. Save all your files now. Oh, crap. Save. Hang on one second. I've got my work system still up. Oh, man. Don't. Don't. Okay. Save. There we go. Phewee. <laughs> that wouldn't have been good. Theoretically, allegedly... That these pictures, if it was true... Oh, who cares? Let's say it was between Salah and Allah. The point is, it doesn't really matter, does it? You're getting rid of your cats in a couple of hours. Well, yeah. Sam first, BBJ later. Um, why does this even matter? And if it was true, you would not be reacting like this. Just stop with this false drama for, for views. That your concentration should be on the animals that you're just discarding like they've run their course. What does that say about 
Allah asking for these kinds of pictures. Mm. Like, wouldn't you be bothered if your husband was receiving like pictures like this? Mm -hmm. Please, I'm sure he was like, oh, please don't, don't send me pictures. Right, you're so virtuous. What does he have it saved on? Oh no, she's drinking from the other hand now. She sniffed it, and it, that other one's so bad she can't have that near her nose anymore. Ugh, what a nasty thing! Nasty, nasty thing. His phone, his phone was probably from like two years ago. Exactly, it's probably from like years ago. It's probably mm. an old photo, and it's no proof that it's of Salah. So, Ella, why did you have this saved on your phone? Your wife must love that. Yes. A lot of de youths around here. BB is angels. Sweetest angels of the 10th and nth degree. Okay, I don't care, babe. I need to like postpone another month so I can bring the cats with me somehow. No. Even if I wanted to bring the cats, how how would I keep them from the 28th until like when I go back to I can't keep them at my mom. You're not going to. Let's let's just be clear. Stop messing around just because you're getting a bit of kickback. If you would have wanted to take the cats with you, you'd have put things in place. Um, you would have put things in place that this would have gone a whole lot different. Um, you're just horrible. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, She's great. not pregnant. Charming. <laughs> Charming. Great to be first choice there. <laughs> I was like, no, I don't want to hang on a minute. Third choice. <laughs> APD probably have you. <laughs> it's not pregnant. I was just showing how much of a creepy and horrible husband he is to that poor woman. Right? Like, I know what pictures. We know what pictures are in each other's phones. Like, I would freak out. <laughs> You don't know that that's his only phone, love. You'll find men in the Middle East have numerous phones. Um, it's a thing. Whether they're cheating or not cheating, there's there's different phones for different things. Um, so, yeah. Mm, okay. Like, that. if that was Salah, if that picture's not even in his phone. So, it, the wow. fact that it's still in Allah's phone, though, and not... Look at how she snooped all the way through his phone. Yeah, it wasn't in his phone when you left. You don't know if it's in his phone now, do you? Like, you don't know if he's got a red light in his bedroom again. <laughs> in apparently the original intended recipient. Oh, I don't know. That's... You might be in there with APD because um, didn't she? She she um was a bit of a <clears throat> pest, wasn't she? With um, what was his name? Quintance. Something that young guy who was scared for his life when he ended up around her house. Oh, God, that was a chapter, wouldn't it? Man, wow. God, that was years ago. Whoa. So weird. Anyway, deep fake eyebrow. <laughs> totally I ignoring to BBJ. Up, like, for sure, sounds like an important convo you wouldn't ignore. Looks like your cats might need you. Chantel, looks like your elderly cat there behind you, like might want you. Right. Make the most. Well, of her. Anna Loverly, trust me, I know everything about my my husband. I know about his past. He knows about my past. Nobody's an angel. No, it's and rude, but... <laughs> I just want. I know everyone's like freaking out. Oh, look at what is that? His name Rupert Quintence or something like that. The American guy the pictures the leaked pictures like <laughs> please please it just it, there's nothing to to explain like oh no even if did she wow well oh god let's just hope not to the shelter let's hope that he is well in a better environment you'd have to go you'd have to go some for a worse environment and she, look how happy she is just a few hours beforehand. This is so sick in the head. If it was him, how can how can I expect him not to have any pictures mm -hmm. of women? How can I expect him to never be with a woman? 
because uh, he's, <laughs> uh, he's Muslim and he lives in Kuwait and he's uh, Syrian. So you won't be breaking the rules if you had a brain. Okay, gotcha. You know what I mean, though? Like, I can oh, bring what any pic does from the she? And and Hang on, let's go and have a look. Hang on, let's go and have a look. What a horror. She's doing this to upset people. She's doing it on purpose. There's no question. Oh, God. Chubby is gone to his forever place. The woman who adopted him seems seems amazing. Okay. He got in one more bees. He got out of his carrier, but I got in some last hugs before handing him over. Yes, I am very sad and I will miss him forever. But sometimes in life we have to make these decisions and they are never easy. Bye, Beezer. You will always be a big Beezer in my heart. You sicko. What a sicko. Ugh. She loves this. She loves upsetting her audience. Um, I'm absolutely sure of it. She gets off on it. Yeah. And you can say the eyebrow. Oh! That's you can unbelievable, say the eyebrow. Isaac. Hi, Ash. That is absolutely unbelievable, Isaac. How could she? She's still using these cats as side characters on her channel. And doing this, this makes me feel sick. What's wrong with her? Lola, hi. But literally, and I don't like to bring this up, talk about anybody from my past. No, oh, Tony had the same, same hair and eyebrow. Oh, shut up. As Sala. Same, 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 same. No same. one cares about this crap. Chantel, nobody cares. <sighs> In red light, too, uh, as the picture or as like Sala used to have. Anyone can have a, a red light picture, you know, a red light. So, yeah, that's all I have to say about that. That's it. A lot of like, I think a lot of Arab men have. Um, no, nor would I for what, nor would I. Um, she's her own demise. She's only got herself to blame. Um, only got herself to blame for when this goes wrong. And it's not an if, it's a when. Um, yeah, how to absolutely ruin your existence, drag your only means of income into the gutter. I mean, what else can she do? What else can she do? She can't do OnlyFans. Um, she wasn't any good at it. The fat, the fat person thing is taken up there. She didn't have enough feeders that wanted to see her naked. So what, what's her job prospects? <laughs> oh, well, none of us will feel sorry, will we? I won't. Not after this. She, she's generated this all for herself. Not a care. Not a care for anyone or anything around her. Or even herself. Uh, her future. <sighs> So, I would really just be explaining, if I were Allah, to my wife, why I have pictures nope. of other women on my phone. Hmm. Seems interesting. Unless she's in on this weird grift. I don't know. Grift? That's a bit rich from you. Grift? Yeah, I mean, she's known him three and a bit months. Um, that's not enough to give up anything, isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't is it, rather? It's all speculation at this point. <sighs> He's trying to dox fake pic of me. He will see the results soon legally. Oh. Oh, sorry, Andrew. I, I missed that machine. one. Um, yeah, it's on a community post on her channel. I have everything from my kitchen laid out here. So I'm going to give all this stuff away. Yes. Who would want it?
I mean, can you imagine going to... I mean, I would if I was in Canada and she was having an open house. Oh, yes, I'd be there. <laughs> I'd be there cow tipping like no one's business. I'd have the 40 bucks ready to buy some old crap. Um, but, like, can you imagine the filth in that house? You couldn't have people there and then expect that. I mean, she could give stuff away, I guess. But, I mean, come on. Would you? Hi, Tracy. A plus. I want salad so he kept the pig. Mm-hmm. Oh, is a bear. She'll I don't her. know what's going on. If she does go to Q8, she'll kill her channel off. Um, it's too boring. Um, no one likes Salah enough. No one likes her enough. She's got no side characters. Um, it's just boring. Um, she won't be leaving. After March, after March, it starts proper warming up in the Middle East. And for her, not very hot is too hot for her. Um, so, yeah, she'll just be in all the time in air conditioning. That'll be it. Where's the content there? There won't be any. So she'll kill her channel anyway. If she doesn't go, her, her views will go through the roof. They they will, depending on what which way she spins it. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if she's going to get back with Nads. I really wouldn't. Nothing would surprise me with this creature. Speaky from, like, I don't know, like, he says he doesn't have anything against Sala. Well, what, what, why, mm-hmm. why do all this, you know? Yeah, I mean... That, that that Netflix documentary, wasn't it? Don't F with cats. I mean, people will put up with a lot against other human beings, but when it comes to animals, mm-mm. It's like, basically her chat is her viewers when it comes to agreeing with her getting rid of the cats and all of this nonsense. Um, And that's not many. <laughs> you understood that, baby? <laughs> Hi, Nikki. As Muslims, this is beyond wrong and have him. It is. It is. Mm. Never involve the police. Yeah. That's the problem with her. The cats are still alive, but the cat... Aww. She will. Sweetest age. She'll, she'll just sleep all day and eat all night. Not a lot of difference between what she does now. I mean, she won't actually understand that Ramadan you're spo- is supposed to be a challenge. It's supposed to make you humble. It's most supposed to give your body a rest. It's supposed to make you think about people less fortunate than yourselves. Um, but no, she's already got a plan in place for Ramadan. Um, she, she's just going to sleep all day and wake up when sun goes down, which is about half past five that time. Of, well, probably earlier than that, about five. Um, and then she'll start scoffing pretty much the same as what she does now. Sleeps all day, eats all night. No sufferance for our Chantel. Oh, no. Angels. I can't take my cats to Kuwait. It does. It's sick, isn't it? It's sick. I just can't do it. There's no possible way. Like it. She loves upsetting people, and she's she's upset people on mass here, her viewers and her subs, and you you know her reaction channels are absolutely disgusted with her. Um, and she loves it. She loves it because she's gaslighting everyone. It's, for it to be possible would be near impossible. And not the best thing for them. <clears throat> what has Salah said about everything? <laughs> not much, because he's unbothered. Like, he stays unbothered. Even by um, Chef Shark Tooth. <laughs> Sorry, that's very... Yes! Um, Nikki, I'm going to be leaving in like um, a month or so. What? Another month? <laughs> hey! Oh, thanks, babe, for saying that. People act like Sala can't have more. Hey, she's staying another month. A month or so. So let's say six weeks. So she, she's not leaving at the end of the month then. Okay. End of next month. End of March. Ooh, is that when, when does Ramadan stop? I think it is the end of March this year. Let's have a look. Ramadan, where is it? 22nd of March ends the 20th of April. Oh no, what if she misses a few days? <clears throat> More than one type in women. <laughs> like, like, oh, he was mm-hmm. skinny. Yeah, but he's not with a skinny person anymore. So what does that tell you about that skinny person? You don't know that. <laughs> Maybe he is right now. 
<laughs> no one cares. No one cares, Chantel. I think you've just... I think this is pretty much the end of your channel. Won't happen overnight, but this is the drip, drip, drip. It's like the Death Watch beetle is there. Being skinny is not enough to keep a man. Imagine. Oh, imagine. Are you skinny shaming? I'm offended. <sighs> but that's none of my business. Oh, God. Well, she's so wrong. <laughs> I don't know what any of these memes. So we're going to be beezing out of town for a couple days. When? Who? Who's going to be? How much was this? No wonder I'm broke. Babe, made in China. You'll never guess how much these stupid things. She China shaming. Things are. I got this a long time ago. 27 bucks. So that's like what, Katie? Sorry. Okay. So. About, about eight. About eight, KD. Listen. I know, Mary. I don't know what to do. Do you, about seven. The thing is, is I have to get him certified. I have to get him like a passport. Hi, you Cheryl. Pets. How you doing, sweetheart? You all right? Ah, that picture of you in the swimming pool on me on holiday. Hey, get me out of here. Don't you guys think it would be better for Chubby McBoose? Well, you'd made arrangements anyway. Chubby McBoose is gone. So this was all for the sake of it. It's not a question you need to ask. You were getting rid of him today, and he is gone. Nobody knows. <laughs> Nikki. If he breaks up with her for real, he'll have to be homeless, so... It's not easy to get a place. Hmm. I should know, because I spent a whole day running around looking I know for friggin' feel, places Isaac. on Rue Berry. Didn't I? I mean, I, like, when... When she was sort of talking about this and not not giving a crap about it the other day, I was like, I could feel myself getting like a bit choked up about it. Thinking, Christ, like what's who can be like her? Like, how can one person be so disgusting on every level? I mean, it's just horrible, Isaac. I'm so thankful for Sam's Bar Lounge. <laughs> I think I... she is Sam's Bar Lounge. I've said it before. I've no proof of it, but I think she is Sam's Bar Lounge. I, like, my reality right now could be a lot different. Mm-hmm. The people in the pic are calling her Kuwaiti Didi. <laughs> Wait, it would have to be reverse Kuwaiti Didi. I know, Gabrielle. I don't want to think about it too much. <laughs> about Sam. Stop it. He was tweaking bad. <laughs> like, I have his stuff packed up and ready to go. Ugh. I'm standing here outside your door. Just getting rid of the cat, having a little sing song. Yeah. Packed all his stuff up. Yeah, get lost, Sam. Ugh. This just, this is just something else. I'm really sad, but I know that he'll be okay. And anytime I want to find Fuck out how he's doing, you? Oh, and I'm sorry. telling, sorry for swearing. All right, 48 minutes in. That was the first one, wasn't it? I think it was. Is she sad? Singing away, full makeup on, all the right. Hang on, let's have a little look. Yeah, full eye makeup on in a community post of getting rid of him in the car. Smiling away, not not a tear in sight. Shut up. What a creature. These people who are taking my cats. If anything, you don't want them for whatever reason, it doesn't work right, out. She's Call massive me. now. I will do something. I don't know. I seriously mm -hmm. just want to bring them. I want to bring them, but... No, you don't. How's that going to work? You live in a tomb. That house is a tomb in Kuwait. How can you possibly have any more animals in there? Even the hamsters, like, on a tight squeeze. What is she talking about? 
I didn't even think that there would be requirements. Like, once they get to Kuwait... What? Then they have to, like, go through all these customs and things, inspections, or what? No, they don't. No, they don't. You get a pet passport, Chantel. Done it myself. You get the rabies jabs. You get them up to date. You get them microchipped. You get them registered. You get the tilter test. If it comes back okay, your cat gets a pet passport. Goes in the pet carrier, depending on the airline, can either go in the cabin with you or has to go with the other animals and the baggage downstairs. Um... Oh, that's not funny. That's not funny. But like they do. And apparently it's a heated compartment. Otherwise they freeze to death. With the other animals, they even transport racehorses. Some of these flights. Didn't know that. But there are special flights for racehorses. And they have heated areas the same as the normal animals do. Um, And then you get out the other end at the airport. You go through. Then you go to the pet bit with your cat's passport or your dog's passport or your horse's passport. And you go into the customs. They give the cat the once over to make sure it looks all right. They check the passport. They check the microchip to make sure it's with the passport. And that's it. You pick the cat carrier up and you walk out the damn airport. It's no different than with people, apart from we're not microchipped yet. The microchip is just in our passports. Oh, that was a conspiracy theory. We're not microchipped yet. Hmm. <laughs> That'll be Hi, the five G. I have nowhere to keep him either. Yeah. Don't try and make out you're sad. I mean, obviously people can find out if they're going to shelters. They're not. Hi. B. How could you? Are you okay? You? Well, you wouldn't know, would you? You wouldn't know, would you, Chantel? Because the first thing you was going to do was take her to the vet. And you didn't bother. It's going to be cheaper to get shot of her, isn't it? <clears throat> no, my family can't because my mom has a dog oh, who eats you. cats for breakfast. Like, he hates cats. He hates you more. That dog hates you. What's his name? Buster. Is it Buster, the dog's name? Absolutely hates her. <sighs> Tinky Winky, stop being dumb. What oh, do you mean? <laughs> Don't make fun of him or he'll block you. I feel like you're giving up everything that makes you you. If you really analyze it, I'm moving on to a more what stupid fighting chapter of my life than <laughs> this, you know, like <laughs> she's moving on to a more nurturing chapter of her life. What by chucking her best friend out, getting rid of him, surplus to requirements, and dumping her cats. How very nurturing of you, Chantel. What what it must be like to be loved by you more to myself than my cats he does look like a grumpy old man Aisha he's very grumpy he's not a native speaker exactly so in her tender days Buster can smell evil he probably doesn't know the bear part he probably just saw the part where he said he wants him <clears throat> I can't believe she just we read that to... out. She read that out. Buster can smell evil. And then just moved on to the next bit. Buster can smell evil. In Canada right now. That's why I wholesale Melissa. I know that's like, it's such a weird concept to Westerners that people, what? not everybody from other parts of the world, really want to be here. Like, it's not an urgent rush, you know? No, Anna Loverly. No offense, but... <laughs> yes, she does. <laughs> I mean, BBJ, yeah, she's 20. Gum swelling? Maybe. Oh. When I floss them, it does that because I don't do it. You enough. don't floss them. You, didn't, you came back from Cuba and had lost your toothbrush for three weeks. Three goddamn weeks you didn't clean your teeth. 
you've said to us before what people get up in the morning and brush their teeth why um um, because it's disgusting if you don't fat so Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's, it's absolutely beautiful. It's romance. We can Hello, only dream where are we going to salam? Oh, stop it, Chantel. Oh, God. Yeah, that's right. She did the cat party. Yeah, the cat, the cat party. Yeah. Mm-hmm. She did none of it. Nope, she didn't. She got annoyed with the cats and was upset that um, Sam didn't really like her anymore. I wonder why. Can you imagine his family? Wow. I mean, can you imagine what his family must think? Wow. It beggars belief. It can't be real, any of this. It can't be real. I've lived in the Middle East. This can't be real. It's bad enough being Western. You, you know, <laughs> it's bad enough. You, you, it's not ideal, you know, for every every family out there kind of thing. It's the same as if you're Catholic, like devout Catholic. Like, you don't really want your son or your daughter bringing somebody else back who's not of the same religion. It's the same, it's the same with Muslim families. Like, it, it's not ideal. <laughs> Thank you very much, Aziz. You have a good day too. You take care. <laughs> oh, yeah, she's such a catch. We're all jealous of her. <laughs> Hi, Lyric. Oh, I needed a few days <laughs> off of this one, I'm telling you. Does my head in. Uh, Bill's up. So. Yeah, I know. A whole bunch of people unsubscribed are so mad at me for the cuts. Oh, you don't. That, that doesn't thinking, matter. Like, it's not their decision. It's not. Yeah, come on, Chantel. That doesn't matter. Just like when you lost a load of subs during the NAD stage, you'll just go and buy them all back again. Won't help your views, but hey, you can just go buy some more subs. We can all do that if we want to. Doesn't earn you any money. I, like, what would they do? They have no idea what they would do yeah. in that situation, you know? Like, <laughs> when it comes to Chantel and the rest of the human race, are we sure? Same species? Are we sure? Yeah, and and to detract. Yeah, she yeah she does it. She does she does certain things. I'm sure for people who've got earbuds in, she she's not without this because when I I've caught my microphone before with my finger now, and I know I don't, I don't listen to my my streams back. But I know it's a horrible sound. And I know I've done it. And I'm like, oh, sorry. Sorry, earbud people. That's a horrible sound. She does certain things just just so it sounds awful for earbud people. Because if she can annoy someone, she will. Just because you think that I'm leaving my cats for a ma fake marriage, like, you're so wrong about it. So okay. I don't know what to tell you, you know. What's for lunch? Oh, boy. Oh, God. I don't know. I'm going to wait for my mom and then see what we're going to do. Hang on. Is she trying to make out that her mum's got... But in the car, it was just her and the cat, no mum. Or was she driving to her mum's? Oh. oh she, well, we never know. She just lies, doesn't she? Maybe Sam will run after me at the airport, you know, like they do in the movies. Oh, shut up. Poor boys. It'll be better for him, guys. He needs stability in his life. Like, I mean, if he is going where she says he's going, then um, you know. it will be better for him. Why would, it, why would it matter in a year from now what I do? Like, I can't say... Uh, because your health could be... Ooh, bad screen grab. Put her evil eyes. Um... Because your health could be absolutely shocking. You could have been out the country too long that you've lost your health insurance in Canada. You could be penniless and stranded in QA. I mean, what does it matter? <laughs> God. And I worry about my retirement when I look at my pension and I'm like, wow, that's not achieved as I hoped it would have. Um, these are the things that worry me. And this is like for when I retire, not next year or the year after or the year after that. Um, I've gone many years until that. It's going to have to rally around somehow. She's like, so what next year? 
okay, next year, next year. Look out, it seems like, like, I mean, the plague days, the height of the plague days was only five minutes ago, wasn't it? It was a couple of years ago now. Time goes quickly, Chantel. You've managed to absolutely kill your channel in about three and a half, four months. Carry on, mate, carry on. Where could we possibly be in a year's time? Well, let's hope that Sam's going to be a damn sight happier than you will be. Because, you know, you like to talk about karma. I'm not really one for karma. I've seen the nastiest get, to get away with everything for years and never had any of it back. But, you know, we live in hope. I'm not going to regret this. Maybe I will. I don't know. <laughs> like, I can't predict the future. And oh, you got I can't off. live my life. Like... <laughs> At this time, this is the right decision. Because what's the possible other possibilities? <laughs> yeah, my you know? Yeah, basically. Scary. Yeah. Scary eyeballs. My three leftover gummies. <laughs> that top. Of course, I'm going to miss them. But they're absolutely like... Absolutely gonna... horrific. I mean, that top be well taken care of so checks and stripes yep well known to go together Sam. he was free now if my mm. memory serves me right and it might not this isn't the first time she's got rid of a pet is it didn't she have a kitten um before sam and it was too much for her and she gave it back i mean she didn't have it long like a few days i think am i wrong in that remembering that i might be but i i don't think i am yes i know people always use the argument well he was on tinder looking for canadian i was actually on tinder looking for arab men like i hey. was attracted to arab men so you were you were on tinder looking for any old dick Come on, Turkish house. You got all passed around there. Well, he was probably just attracted to. Do you think she done that as well? I I think she did. I think she did have a kitten that only lasted a couple of days, and she took and she got rid of it. And then and then Sam came along a few months after. I think Western women, like you know, I was putting for different areas. It didn't mean that I ever thought that I would marry somebody and move to their country yes you know that was all you wanted to do you said you was getting married after two weeks of chatting with him on text message grow the fuck up so it's could be the similar situation i hate when people use that as an excuse mm -hmm. like, <laughs> it was just so happy it was so fast and haphazard because they're making farewell videos that's of right yeah, and she made out it was too manic and it was too much for her and, yeah, and that was the end of that kitten. That's right. Yeah, I thought I thought she'd done it before. But, I mean, all right, nothing on this scale like where she'd had a mages, but it's not. it's been known, isn't it, for the cats to be too much effort. <clears throat> Perfect timing for BBJ when her vet bills are going to start going up because she's got no pet insurance on them. So, yeah, perfect all round disgusting i don't want to do that that's i don't like that sad stuff i hate that sad stuff actually i don't want to because mm -mm. then it will make it so <laughs> i'll be so sad editing that i can't chantel you I don't can't. have to chantel like everybody else has put cats cat videos up of your cats because they're more upset about it than you are there's not a reaction channel that isn't absolutely furious about this um Mm. There really is something wrong with her. This is her worst. I can't have a cat right now. You can Pets never have a, a cat again. Responsibility that I was probably never, what? with my type of lifestyle and everything, was probably never, never ready for in my life. You was with BB for seven years. What do you mean, your type of lifestyle? You've only been a weed head for the last, well, a weed and other things, the last couple of years. What are you going on about? You know? I hang on. to feel the emotion. Hang on. Was it not that long ago we were talking about adoption? 
Oh, God. Yeah. They're torturing themselves on purpose. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. That's an actual thing. No, it isn't. Uh, People are genuinely upset that you've got rid of the cats. They have been characters on your channel. They've been integ integral characters on your channel since you've had your channel. BBJ first, and then along came Sam. What what part of your brain cannot realise that if people are invested in you, and actually people are more invested in the cats at this point, they're probably even more invested in Pete's, and that's a stretch than you at this point because you're just the train wreck. What 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 is it in your head and your heart that can't see? That people, because these are real animals, they are real players in the whole shit show that has been you. That people will be upset that you're just casting them aside. I guess psychopath like you wouldn't grasp those basic feelings. Because it's going to be horrible on your channel. It's going to be weird on your channel for everyone who watches you not to see those cats. But for you, Happy days. Good o. Got rid of the cats. Got rid of Pete. Whee-hee. Ugh. <clears throat> you became a citizen after 15 years. I know. It took like, I know like on like um, mm -hmm. 90 Day Fiance, um, that one guy was Syrian. That's for the U.S. Mm -hmm. though, but it took him like three years to get to the U.S. to get granted uh, visas for the U.S. So, but that's not like, <laughs> you know, I'm sure if he wanted into Canada. And that's, and that's the thing, isn't it? Um, like, when she first got back to Canada and she was back on her gummies and whatever else she was on, I don't know, I'm not here to judge. Um, but she was, she's been happier since she's been in Canada, apart from piling on the agony a few times because people are like she's well happy she's not in q8 anymore with her husband look how good look how pleased we was expecting wailing and crying and i miss my husband no she's just loved it since she's been back been stuffing her face with all her favorite takeaways she's been doing her gummies doing her vape whatever it is she's been doing um so she's going to go back to q8 and what she's got in her head now that she was happy there she was horrible when she was out there. Really horrible. He could get it so much easier than the likes of me. Okay. Mm -hmm. So no, no, it doesn't right. make any sense horrible? for him to be using. I think BBJ is the big concern. Where is she going? Oh, I can't even think about that. I'll choke up. <sighs> We're all the bloody invested in these cats. Probably all care about them more than she ever has. Isn't that awful? Me for anything. So yeah. Other than love. <laughs> well, something you know nothing of. Every man you've ever been with, you've cheated on. Um, every friendship you've had, you've trashed. And now the animals. Even they didn't come out on Sky, did they? That's really bad. You guys want to have a Riverside Pizza Bees tonight? Oh, great. Let's have a celebration. Got rid of Sam. <clears throat> so A Riverside Pizza Bees. I'll take it that's a type of pizza. Because it's bloody freezing in Canada. She's not taking us down to the Riverside, is she? Ah... <sighs> Well, I know a lot of you hate me. Like, how can you get rid of Sam? Don't have a choice, like, for my particular situation right now. Well, that's true, actually. <laughs> yes, she has. Apart from Pete, but, I mean, I guess he got paid later on. But, um, I mean, she run debt up for Pete, but, I mean, they were only kids then anyway. Um, but, yeah, it's all been transactional. All been transactional. What a shame. And I'm not heartless, but that's because she's going to go out to dinner with her mum, I reckon, once she's ditched the cat off. Hi, Nola. It's a lot colder How than it used doing, to be, sweet? even just a year ago. 
like I feel a lot co- not colder but like stoic Whoa. in a lot of ways like... stoic <laughs> <laughs> stoic <laughs> nasty did it nasty stoic I don't think that's the right word. Cold-hearted, mean, vexatious, spiteful, vindictive, rank, stoic, maybe not so much. You know, I can never, exactly, I can never do right. If I keep my cat, I'm an animal abuser. That's my fear. (laughs) I've got that. Um... Because she she came out with that story about Sam that he's going to a friend of the family and she's had rescue cats before and all of this. Well, why wouldn't you take them both? Why why wouldn't you take them both? I kind of think that too. I don't want to think it, but uh, it's just too horrible to think of, isn't it? It's just too horrible. It's too upsetting to think of. We these aren't even our cats, and I can feel great big lump coming up at the thought of that. Hi, Marion. How you doing? You all right, sweetheart? You think so as well? Ah, <sighs> not yet. Mind you, if she ends up living around there, God. Whew, good luck to them. You know, I see comments like, "Oh, she's a piece of crap," but at the same time. I guess I'm kind of happy they're going to a better home. Well, yeah. Like, <laughs> well, well, yeah, there is that. If they are going to a better home, is BBJ going to a better home or is she going for that dirt nap? You know? You sicko. Give me a break, you know. I think so. Hmm. Well, no one's going to be around for another another three months of a QA arc. I mean, it's just shite. It's just utter shite and boring. And it'll be too hot, so it'll just be her on the blue sofa stuffing her face, raging and missing gummies. Like people aren't going to hang around for that. Um, people don't people don't forgive people for things like this with pets. I mean, they're more likely to forgive someone for doing something horrible to a person than they are an animal. I don't know why that is. It's just just how it is I'm not saying it's right or wrong but it just is how it is oh you think so too oh. did you share updates maybe i've not shown it yeah i haven't shown it but we we went over there so yeah she put it up about half well we looked at it about half an hour ago maybe just over um isaac told us it was on a community post how disgusting so disgusting yep she does this is the worst one she's ever done this is the worst grandma was bad really bad um but this i don't know maybe it's because we didn't see grandma all the time um we didn't see grandma at all but this seems worse because we're all used to seeing the cats you think of foodie beauty you think of that her stupid little intro with the cats in the sunglasses and she's made her channel branded by these cats and now she's doing this (sighs) yeah no there isn't there isn't i mean she could have got a two-bedroom apartment with pete's um she could have got a two-bedroom apartment with Pete's. Got the, there's enough money for that, even if it's not in a good area. Um, Pete's has to get a job in Cornwall, whatever. Like and and looked after the cats. He could have he could have kept the cats. Um, let her do one more trip to Q8 because there wouldn't be another one after it. No way. But this this is too much. Ah. Uh. I know, she's sickened everyone, isn't she? Oh, she'll just buy back some more, but it won't make any difference, like, because her views will plummet. Um, Hurry up and go back to Q8 if that's where you are going. Um, I don't even think if she gets back with Nad, she'll be forgiven for this one. She's been forgiven for so much, but this one, I don't think so. My rationalisation skills? I know. Me and Chantel could save a group uh-huh. of orphans from a burning building. We should do that. 
<laughs> and they would still try to find something bad about it and spread more Chime. hate. There are zombies following any hater, oh, any hater channel. Though. Yeah, it's so Chime true. Strawberry. I uh, just, uh, it beggars belief. It absolutely beggars belief. Um... True. Uh. It's a tough call. Hey, Golden Girl! Sometimes we have to make them. I was thinking that in bed last night. I'm like, okay, so what's the alternative? Mm -hmm. So I started researching, like, <clears throat> you know, the airline, different airlines, policies. I mean, the thing is, if you, if I guess, if you take them to a shelter, um, they're not going to tell you what happens. You sign them animals over and that's the end of that. Now, if they're not going to a shelter or going to the vet um, to be put down, then, and she's homed them with other people. I mean, my cat had kittens. And for years, I got pictures of those kittens because I was in floods of tears. I mean, we didn't need nine cats. We didn't. You know, the kittens had to have houses, like homes. So they all, all got new homes. But every time one of them went, oh, that was me. I was in floods of tears. I was in a, such a state. It was awful. And um, for years, I got photos through on email of the kittens as they grew, as they, as they grew up. Um, so if she hasn't sent them to a shelter and they haven't been put down by a vet, there is no reason why she couldn't say, look, I'm really going to miss these animals. Could you give me a little photo of them? Like, you know, and we'd know that they weren't in her house because I used to get pictures of, oh, look, this one's got a right cushy life. Look, he's laying in the bed there. Um, there's no reason why that wouldn't happen. And then bringing the cats into Kuwait, they would have Let's to have like so. a whole bunch of things done. And then I'm thinking like once he's in Kuwait, mm -hmm. what's he going to do in that? He loves the windows in this place. You guys know our apartment is smaller, has no windows. Well, the apartment has no windows in Kuwait. So that carrier bag that covers that little trap door window looks like the Ikea bag that is actually onto the hallway outside. So that's why it's so damn no noisy. So you can hear the kids all the time because it's a broken window. Got ya. I know. It's, uh, she didn't deserve her, did she? She didn't deserve her at all, ever. Why would I not, like, let him? It would be selfish, I think, of me. Because, yeah, like, if I'm just thinking of myself. Mm -hmm. Oh, stop ah, it. You're going to choke me up. I see. People don't think that. All people right. think I'm selfish with everything You're... and that I don't. Um, I can say that I'm I'm I am selfish sometimes, but with with my cats, no, I'm doing like what's the best thing for them in any mm. case. <clears throat> oh, can you imagine? Can you imagine if it turns out that any of those cats end up in the shelter? Um, I mean they're not going to be able to find them if um, BBJ's gone to the vet. Um, but. Mm. If they find any of those cats in the shelter, that will be the end of her. Absolutely the end of her on YouTube. Uh, this is awful, isn't it? I'm getting choked up now. Mind you, I'm softy anyway. But, ugh. Like, with this situation, anyways. Can you imagine it? Even in this chat here, we're all more upset about these cats than she is. She's been laughing and singing. Grinning away, talking about a stupid picture with her stupid fake husband, maybe, maybe not, girl from now or last year or whenever. Like, what the fuck? It's a hard decision, and it's not probably oh, yeah. the ultimate. It's not going to make them ultimately happy, but in the long run, it will. What? That doesn't make any sense. It's not going to ultimately make them very happy, but in the long run, it will. English major. I don't think Sam would be happy um, going to Kuwait. I really don't. I don't. He would. He would be cooped up. Um, and what about Harry? He would eat Harry. Who gives a fuck about Harry? <laughs> Give that to to one of the little kids in the hallway. It's a hamster for Christ's sake. It's a child's pet. All right, people. We've got hamsters. Actually, I think Marion. Marion, has you got a hamster? I think you have, haven't you? hamsters or guinea pigs um don't mean it like that but you wouldn't give away animals that you'd had seven odd years for a hamster that you got for a bit of content and was with two weeks there's plenty of kids around 
Salah's friends have got kids. They love hamsters. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm talking about Salah like, what? Oh, it will. Yep. Salah's English has never been bad. I said that earlier, Strawberry. No. Like, when you look at what the internet does when it comes to people messing around with animals, I know the Netflix of the Don't F With Cats was, like, a completely different thing. But people are more likely to forgive people being nasty to other human beings than they are animals and kids. Animals and kids. You just get it. The internet won't tolerate it. Society doesn't tolerate it. You don't You don't pull that crap and expect to earn a living off of it, foodie. Look at her damn face. Oh, mm-hmm. oh for sure. They'll get bored of him if he's still with us. It's very good, babe. So anyways. Stop yelling, you vile pig. I can't pig. stay long because. You've got to go and get rid of your cat. Yeah, we I know. Plans. I have my CPAP all ready to go. Baby, I'm ready to go. <laughs> wow, she's singing, baby, get ready to go. Knowing that she's about to get rid of a cat that she's had six years, never to be seen again. She's a psycho. Mm-hmm. No, it's not Harry's fault. I love all little animals. I do love all little animals. But, yeah, don't don't use me as an excuse that you're trying to ding off your cats. She didn't want her cats when she was with Nat. She was talking about getting rid of them. This isn't a new thing just because of Salah. She, any bloke, them cats would have been gone. Oh. Hmm. No, I don't think so. No, she was talking about getting rid of them. It, she was talking about getting rid of them when she was with Nads. Ah. Uh, maybe, well, it's all going to play out in the wash, isn't it? But unfortunately, it's going to be too late for the cats or the best thing that's ever happened to them. Let's hope. Let's hope for the brighter outcome here. Because the other outcome for BBJ is just like heartbreaking. Having highlights. Why are you analyzing the girl in the picture? Oh my gosh. She's loving Thanks, it. Thanks, baby. <laughs> I mean, who cares? Like, <laughs> you people are so crazy. Oh no, not a picture. Like, that could potentially be. His face is not even showing. No way you would take them. That takes effort. It takes effort that I would be willing to do if it was their best interest. I must admit, Burby, uh, she, she's winding me up. I'm a finger picker. I pick the edges of the skin on my fingers when I'm nervous and when I'm wound up. Um, mm, she, she, she's getting my, she, she, she's there on my nerves. <clears throat> oh, Rachel Langley. <laughs> Again, you're wrong about me. I know that really, really must. Oh, I don't know what a, your problem is. There's a photo that that Allah uh, uh, has brought out of what may or may not be Salah in bed with a girl from I don't know last week, two years ago, whenever. Um, by the fact she's reacting like this, I think it's all staged. Um, this is all for views and drama and money, money. That's all that matters to foodie. Attention, food, money, kind of all go together for her, don't they? Yeah, I'm glad her money's not up like it was before. Mm -hmm. Comes the same when uh, Nad's actually on. Uh, she's like, I gave him everything. Uh, actually, it probably works out that by him being around, uh, you earn just as much off of him as he ever did you. <laughs> what does that say? God, like this person, for example, I'm pretty sure I've seen them say it's all bollocks. not nice things about. Like, like I'm sure it's all staged, um, just by the fact that she's not going batshit loony, um, like she normally would. Who knows? About me for like years. It's like, why follow me if if I bother you so much? You've been complaining for years about my the way I live my life. So who's the dumb one here? You. They are. 
<laughs> yeah, we could well have. She's going to one of the most expensive places that she can find um, to have her money divided by four whilst having to pay off a ton of taxes and bankruptcies. Uh, she's probably creeping into her third bankruptcy now. Um, <laughs> never mind, I could have cleared a lot of it, couldn't she? Instead of rubbing it in everyone's faces. Do you remember when she was doing that? And I was like, God, you're abhorrent. Like, everyone was worried when the co- when COVID was going on. All of our wages, I mean, mine were obliterated. I was just living off credit card. Um, but everybody's wages were less than they were. And there she was, rubbing in our faces how much money she earned. Well, look where we are now, foodie. Look where we are. And the fuckers probably still earns more than I do. <laughs> but <laughs> I'm all right. You know. I'm sure men do that all the time. Oh, here's a picture with my person, you know, like flexing or whatever with their guy friends. So I'm not surprised by that picture. <clears throat> I've done that. Mm. You know, whatever. It's probably a picture from years ago. It's like, <laughs> well, yeah, there's I no don't one even left. Know, like... I mean, there is no one left. Um, are you in the Netherlands? Lovely. What's your weather like? Is it still really cold over there? Um, yeah, she got rid of the cats and Pete, who's next. There's no one left. She's got no friends left, has she? The only friend she had was, what was her name, Rena, And she got fed up of her. And then Shannon, and she fell out with her. She falls out with everyone. So, I don't know. She'll be back with Nads. <laughs> Never mind. Number one, like, you've seen our new apartment. There's not even red lights in our new place. So how can that be a new picture? Hello. <laughs> like... <laughs> anyway. Wow. You can't really you catch... to suffer. Well, that's on you, Angelica. That makes you weird, not me. Hi, Brittany. Yeah. Um, t- tinky Winky. Prove it is. Mm-hmm. <laughs> there wasn't. Do you know what I want? <laughs> this is really mean. Um, I want her to get there, um, get back to their little love tomb, their love prison cell over in Kuwait, the grimy, horrible place. Um, and there she, she'll be rummaging through it. The minute he's not there, she'll be rummaging through that place like no one's business, um, trying to get evidence on him. And I hope she finds a red light bulb. <laughs> That'll be her. Can you imagine? Why? <laughs> ah, you cheated. <laughs> That'd be good. Are oh, you getting crampy hands? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what I want. I want the red room to still be there. Uh huh. Red lights when you left. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> the love to. <laughs> the minute I leave. All right, Chantal's gone. No, we've been videoing literally until we both like until he, one of us passes out. So, how's that work out? There's a seven hour time difference. How's that working? Hmm. Mm? And hasn't he got like the, the you know the great entrepreneur and his perfume business? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> so there okay well we're just rooting for karma for you and the bot fly offspring <laughs> you are all brain dead whoever thinks well, that's like, the like to thing. See people... actually blue star that's the thing for i mean there's plenty of dodgy places for shenanigans to go on in the middle east people think there isn't there is there is um it's like one of those places that, yes, you don't want to get caught doing anything. Um, but there are places that people do things that they're not supposed to do. Um, doesn't matter what it is, drinking, weed, girls, what it, it's all there. It's all there. It's like an underbelly. Um, <clears throat> could be anywhere. That could have been anywhere um, that he could have, I don't know popped round, popped round for a little bit of shenanigans um didn't need to be in their apartment 
didn't need to be in their apartment at all. People think that, oh, it's the Middle East. These things don't happen. Oh, yes, they do. Oh, yes, they do. Um, she's so stupid. She's so stupid. Yeah, well, she, well, did she buy bath bombs from Lush? I mean, where's she going to have a bath? The sea? Better not do. Actually, in the environment. Over this and like acting like all is some savior, like Moses giving the friggin' scriptures or something. Like, get a life. Hi, Jane. <laughs> what do we talk about? Our future. What we're gonna do. We plan things. Well, that's true. You know, talk about Harry. What? Hang on. I love Hang on. I'm too busy with the chat because she's winding me up and picking my fingers like no one's business. They're getting. <laughs> I've shredded them up to my elbow now. <laughs> Um, what she, what someone said? What do they talk about? Come on, this is, I, I've always been interested in this. So there, okay, you are all brain dead. Whoever thinks, wow, like like to see people actually ruminating over this and like acting like all is some savior, like Moses giving the friggin' scriptures or something like. Yeah, well, I think it's all. I think it's all there to get views for everybody all round. So I think it's a great big setup for drama. But if it wasn't, there's plenty of places that he could have had a girl. Plenty. Get a life. <laughs> what do we talk about? Our future. What we're gonna do? We plan things. You know, talk about Harry. What? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I know we shouldn't be laughing. I know we shouldn't be laughing. Um, especially after what she's done today. Um, all right, can you get this? Two newlyweds just about to embark on their life for the rest of their lives. The one and only partner that they're going to be with. Full of hopes and dreams and aspirations for the future. Come on then, foodie, what are you talking about? What, should we have that again? So again, what do you talk for hours and hours about? Brain dead. Whoever thinks. Like, like to see people actually ruminating over this and like acting like all is some savior. Like Moses giving the friggin scriptures or something. Like, get a life. <laughs> what do we talk about? Our future. What we're going to do. We plan things. You know, talk about Harry. Talk about a hamster. You've had two weeks Say before I love you left. You and mushy things. What do you th Say I love you and mushy things. Right. Okay. That's taken me ten seconds. I could just picture myself having this. Well, I did have a long distance relationship for years and years. Sometimes we were together for a few years. Other times we weren't for periods of times, like months on end. <laughs> Hi. Hi, Mustafa. How are you? How's the hamster? Oh, he's good, is he? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, love you. Yeah, love you back. Yeah, no, I love you a bit more. Can't wait to have sexy time. <laughs> Stop, what? <laughs> and he went, okay, bye. <laughs> this has taken 10 seconds. What do they talk about for hours and hours? Okay, I've just run through that pathetic scenario. Shut up. Up, foodie. Take a seat. Try not to break another sofa. I think we talk about. Yeah, what else? <laughs> what else? Yeah. So I mean, what? Whatever. That's it. <laughs> Sounds like I'm convincing myself. So, so that's it. That literally is it. We talk about Harry the Hamster, who we had two weeks before I left. Who? Might not even be with us anymore. We don't know. It's not going well for the animals. Um, we say mushy stuff. Um, tumbleweed, lonely monkey in the background. Ding, 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 ding. Crickets chirping away. <laughs> you guys are funny. Oh yeah, they don't tell her. you anything, flop era. Yeah, they don't even. She doesn't even do that anymore. Go, oh yeah, we watch movies together and meh, meh, meh. <sighs> <laughs> So what else? I know, right? Oh yeah, where's I'm my food? What did you eat? Yeah, I bet. Oh, 
Hi, life is beautiful. Yeah, I get. I guess like, yeah, we plan our future. Yeah, so, babe, when I come over, um, can we go to Burger King, please? Can we get some rice and chicken? Because <laughs> I haven't had that for ever. Ah. Uh. Are you getting? Yeah, Gemini, Gem. I'm getting everything done. Don't wait till the last day. Probably will happen at least the last couple of days. Because honestly, like, I just need Good people to take my stuff. I don't have really much else to do. I bet he feels right special. Do you know what? I think we need to have a GoFundMe for Enola so that we can get you a rodent of some description just to pull the whole man partner, life partner arc together for you. So I know you definitely will be happily ever after and if we need to we'll get some just eats on the go there or a door dash on the go of some dried up old rice and chicken i mean that's the dream man why am i single i'm so jealous of foodie i'm jealous of enola as well and her human man partner man i'm just here with my cats living an uncomplicated existence <laughs> No A plus, they don't. I don't think he calls so. me cootie. <laughs> mm -hmm. So um, I wouldn't be surprised. <clears throat> <laughs> Will you go live while out of town as Pete's going home? No, I think he'll be staying here. I guess. And yeah, he's been he's, he's been saving like um yeah you do you remember when McDonald's had that monopoly thing going on where he collect the little tabs and you know he's probably been getting all his mates to save them up like the whole of QA he's saying it's for charity because some great big killer whale was arriving and he can't afford to feed her that could be a thing sorry Nola yeah I'll probably go live. <laughs> Um, oh, she's gonna go live again, isn't she? In a minute. Three and two, two and one. Three and one or two and one. <laughs> this is gonna play on my mind all damn night. That's why I've not been watching in the last few days. It's been playing on my mind anyway. And um, mm, I know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna wake up stupid early, and we're gonna be back here, and it'll be about half past four my time, and we'll be doing the next chapter of this. I can just feel it in my bones. <sighs> Poor Sam. Yes. Oh, yes. yes, poor Sam. How can you even look at him without crying? I would be broken. Even the thought of it. His chicken gratin. <laughs> Cutie, when do you see Smee? Soon. Some real creeper showed up. I didn't I have climb some spray. it. Oh, I have some mace. Of course, of course. Or like, like coyote 10 past spray? Nine here. Some kind of spray. I'll just use Javix. If somebody comes near me, I'll be like, listen, you do not want to come near me. I will kick your... She will, but it's short-lived. It, it's short-lived. She'll end up with a lot of um, hate viewers. Um, but yeah, get her over to Kuwait. It's so boring. She'll lose everyone. Um, well, I don't know where the money's coming from. It is a, it is a, it is a fair question. Um, she's basically got enough for a flight to QA and that's about it. Um, God knows. I mean, we know she's horrific with money. Um, I guess she hasn't got any rent to pay this month. She's still got a bankruptcy, a tax bill, everything else. Um, I can see her getting stranded over in Kuwait with not a pot to piss in. Um, she don't want to get debts over there. You just get chucked in prison. Oh, yeah, go on, get debts. Get debts over there that you can't pay, Chantel. Go on, do it. <laughs> <laughs> What's that mean, though? <laughs> Rodin of some description. <laughs> I've got, mate, I've got to make light of this because it's genuinely really, really upsetting me what she's doing here. I wish the best for Pete's in his incoming job in his channel. Yeah, hey, I wish the best, of course. And I wish the best, and that's very sweet of you, babe. <laughs> Is that Sarah you know? rubbing salt in the wounds? 
<laughs> nice. Oh, God. What are you talking about? Sam was not evicted, and what Hassan... Is Hassan's... that true? Is that true? Well, I hope it is true. I I wouldn't be I wouldn't be surprised if she's going back to QA and she genuinely does go. I wouldn't be surprised if she's doing a runner. Um, I hope that is true. But oh, are they? See, I'm going to have to get Twitter, but I've never had Twitter because it's just like a toxic hellhole of gossips. <laughs> I'd have to go under like some other name and just use it to like have a little nose around. <laughs> I don't like to have like this. This channel's bad enough. Gets me in enough trouble. <laughs> Get myself in enough trouble. Twitter, that'd be the end of me. Um, <coughs> wow. Oh, and fork sniffers. Okay. Uh huh. Oh, I wonder. Ah, uh, yeah, I unsubscribed ages ago too. I I go on her, I literally go on her channel, click on when she's. I usually don't get past about ten seconds of the advert. I click on her channel, grab the link, come straight out again, nab the nab the video, and away we go. Um, she doesn't get any watch time hours out of me, that's for sure. Ah, uh, newy. So I wonder. Well, oh, now over here. Hang on, I'm losing my chat. Um, over here, if you've got something like that and nothing in place, hence no trustee, then that's the sort of shit that gets a dirty little mark on your passport that you can't leave the country until you've cleared your debts or I've got something in place and all creditors are happy. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Uh this is hmm. I wanted to go back to Q8. Yeah, because it will be the end of her channel. No one can put up with another three months of that bore fest. Especially because she'll be even grumpier because it's gonna start turning hot. Get March out of the way. Um April, May, June. Poof. She finds twenty odd degrees too hot, so she she's not gonna have fun over there. What is their weather like at the minute? Because their weather is cooler than Bahrain. Let's go and have a look. It's weather over in Kuwait City. Let's do that. Because they are a good few degrees cooler. Kuwait City. Let's have a little look. Oh, look, it's warming up as of next week already. So... The last couple of weeks, it's been sitting hmm, around about 14 degrees. Get to this time next week, we're up in the early 20s. So, yeah, give it another month, mid-20s, and it only gets hotter from then. Nice weather. Bit nippy, 2022. Give it another few weeks, it'd be nice. <laughs> <laughs> Babe, I'm going to use this and spray it right in the people's face. Hi, Tiffany. Veronica, you're not blocked. Kijiji bees. No, not Kijiji. Actually, I did put everything Get a need to. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> I'm going to go in like a few minutes. Do big girls get kidnapped? No. Oh, yeah. No. No, that's a good thing. Oh, God. Are you Willy Rot? <laughs> Willy, really, Willy Rot's wife. When is Sam going to the wood chipper? <laughs> Later, 2 p.m. I'm kidding. Babe, calm down. <laughs> I'm so hyper. Babe, this is what happens after I have coffee. I get all hyper. <laughs> um... Go give Sam big cuddles, of course. Being ignored is better than block. <laughs> oh, 
Hello, Mrs. Oh, Red. God, this is getting grim in here. <laughs> Good, thank you. How are you. I don't understand people. Some things you believe what I say, some things you don't. And the things you believe I say are things you shouldn't. What? <laughs> things you believe I say you shouldn't? What the hell does that mean? Don't believe a word that comes out of your mouth. Okay, none of us did. Gotcha. Like the fake love thing. Why would Stella picture it on bed with another girl? Uh, you did say it though. All he, all he had to do was fake love me. No, you said all you had to do was fake love me. Oh my god. Nobody is, so even if it was Sala, he's not allowed to have any past experiences. <laughs> yeah, Willy has been over in, I've seen, um, God, one of the many bouts of plague I've had the last few months. Um, I've seen Willy Rot, um, <clears throat> I, I've seen Willy Rot over in Damn It Danny, if you, Willy Rot was just Edna. Okay. <laughs> the good, the genuine trolls. They were like the trolley trinity. <laughs> With women at all. Was that like, that would be like you marrying somebody today and seeing a picture of them with their ex. Would you care? <laughs> yeah, really. I know, babe. Babe. Next will be a picture of Sala with a puppy in the house. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's not actually her am to have the dog in the house. I knew plenty of Muslims that have had dogs. Uh, most of them do live in kennels outside, air conditioned kennels at that. Um, but Plenty of plenty of the trendy little handbag dogs are in in um, Middle Eastern houses these days. <laughs> Address the deep fake eyebrow. <laughs> oh, I just got it. I forgot what deep fake meant actually. <laughs> Why would Allah have pictures of his friend in bed with women? Oh no. Well, Salah sent it to him yesterday. Right. When your girlfriend breaks your heart, but your wife just breaks your furniture. Yeah, baby, I will never break your heart. I can't promise I won't break your furniture. Oh, my God. What is she doing? Uh, what is she doing? That's true. She did, didn't she? She did say that. Um, I don't know if the picture bothers her or not. I think it's all sort of set up for views, but we'll find out. Could be wrong. Could be wrong. She's not psychotic enough about it. I can't believe. Why is she being smug today of all days? What has she got to be smug about? She's dumping her cats. I still have pictures of my ex on my Facebook from eight years ago and I'm married to someone else, really. Hi, Laganja Estranja. This is true, VI Peasants. <laughs> I'm a hugely jealous person. To be honest, the trolls were the most entertaining part of her channel, to be honest. But she's even locked down too much on that, hasn't she? She's looked, you know, flop era is, is like on the edge, on the edge. But I mean, mm, it's not as good as it used to be. I mean, the chat used to be great to watch. I mean, if it was nothing else, the trolling in the chat was worth watching Chantel because it was funny. Oh, yeah, well, there is that. That's a point. Yeah, there is that. Yeah, she's she's just getting off on being sick in the head and upsetting everyone. She likes it. She likes it. Then, And that doesn't even bother me, that picture at all. Like, like somebody's shoulder with, like, bedhead with highlights. What, 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 why would I care about that? 
Wow, bedhead with highlights. You're just jealous you can't even get any highlights or sex. So. <laughs> when Adam found out Salva calls me Moo Ventura, he laughed so much and now he <laughs> he keeps quoting Jim Carrey lines, really? I love Jim Carrey. Why is your life like a reality show? I don't know. It's like a big episode of Seinfeld. Nonsense. Twitter heads exploding. I know they're like they're like zooming in. Like, what kind of highlights are those? I know. <laughs> yeah, we see. We did see it a little while ago. Um, yeah. Let's hope he has. Let's hope he has. Well, the concern is where on earth is BBJ going? I just hope it's not the vet. <laughs> oh no, that's the eyebrow. <laughs> Maybe deep fake it's eyebrow, me. yeah. Her hair was gorgeous. Oh yeah, like see, people are saying like the dumbest thing. <laughs> Denial, right? I'm a hugely jealous person. That can't even bother someone like me. Like, you're here for me, antics. Well, it's not even like. <laughs> All right. Well, it's it's weird, isn't it? Like, it's outstanding how she literally depends on Salah for her happiness, but it's not happiness, is it? Like, it, it isn't. Because when she was over there with him, we've never seen her look more miserable than she ever had. She, there was nothing to her about just frust other than frustration and venom. Um... I mean, it was even worse than all the bawling and the wailing and the I love him with Nads. Um, she was just horrible over there. So if she wasn't happy there. So I don't, it's very strange. It, it's really strange. Um, I mean, at the end of the day, she needs to rely on herself for her own happiness. Um, but she's incapable of that. Well, every other day is and more lunacy, isn't it? Um, it's just a shame that the cats have got caught up in this. I mean, Pete's needed to get away from her a long time ago, but you know, even so, it's not great. <clears throat> so, I gotta go. I've been saying that for a while. Maybe it was me with the wig on. <laughs> yeah. Oh no, no, it was a skinny person. Well, how do you think? It'd be funny if he's moved out of the apartment and doesn't pick her up from the airport, wouldn't it? Never to be seen again. I feel it's a skinny person. They're not with the skinny person anymore. They wifeed a fat girl. Okay. So what does that tell you? Who the hell? Oh, my God. She's not doing this. She 12. Wifeed a fat girl. How old are you who speaks like this? She's insane. The fat wifey wins. <laughs> what did you win? What on earth have you won, Chantel? What have you won? A bloke that can't travel hardly anywhere. A life full of debt, bankruptcies, tax evasion and ill health. What has anyone won here? <laughs> I am fat, but I also have a fat personality, so. <laughs> it has. 100 pounds. The filters are struggling. There you go. <laughs> yeah, she, she was. was. Giving she was giving a deep. There were genuine. On both sides of them, actually, with both sides of them, there were glimmers of genuine happiness with each other i mean it was damn short-lived but i mean they liked the ride they both got off on the ride of it yeah well that's the thing how do we know how do we know that the girl he was in the bed with isn't wife number two or wife number one or wife number three i mean come on he needs them babies it's expected <laughs> i've had fat women and skinny women none were better or worse there you go. Twitter has exploded quite easily. How, how, it's so weird to talk about somebody that's oh. not even on Twitter. Like, I don't even see their things. How many pics of other women Allah got on his phone? 
why like, he's uh, If that were me, oh, I would be his nice. wife. <laughs> What's a shit show here, mate? <laughs> You're London. Okay. Not far from me. An hour and a half drive <laughs> down to the south coast. So you, you want some sunshine <laughs> and an ice cream in the summertime? Come pay me a visit. <laughs> Thanks for your sub. It means a lot. Mm-hmm. Yeah, keep it. Keep it up. Mm-hmm. Well, hungry fat chick. I mean, she's playing down, you know, being in hospital with an infection. That's exactly how it started with Life by Jen, wasn't it? And it's like once oh, it's just it's just a lot, isn't it? I mean, Candy is just not not horrid like Chantel, but um the end result isn't you know, there's no good end to this. Um, no one's, I was going to say no one's getting a telegram from the Queen, but I mean, literally, sorry, I shouldn't laugh. <laughs> literally, no one is getting a telegram from the Queen anymore, are they? No one's getting a telegram from the King. Um, not out of these phase. Are you in Scotland, Jade? Got a bit, it's cold up there. Kerry's from Scotland. It's being like, yo, let me see your phone right now. Really? You would be I like that as well. In. Yes, basic agreed. Do you know what? If it, oh, what is she doing now? But I mean, if if any bloke said that to me, show me your phone right now. I'd be like, I'll show you the door. Get the Jeff out of here. Get, get away with you. Who do you think you are? Piss off. <laughs> And what's she doing these stupid poses for? What is she winning here? Are these her winning poses? Mm. Pathetic. Mm. 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 <laughs> oh, and this is the look of joy at getting rid of our cats. How pleasant. Oh, was it quite warm tonight? I don't know. What is it? Six degrees down here. <clears throat> Bloody freezing. Sorry, 60 degrees to me. It's bloody freezing. I know. I know. Got you. Got you on that, Zoe. A hundred percent understand. She she's really pulled this one. And I hope it is gonna be the demise. I really do. I hope this is the thing that absolutely tanks her channel. Won't happen overnight, but I think it could be the nice little slippery slope that we've all been looking for. Yeah, I mean, and, uh, trying to act, well, is that what that is? Trying to act tough and cool or just a damn fool? She just looks like a damn fool, doesn't she? Doing child things in a childish way um, whilst trying to make out she's a damn prize. All right, got ya. <laughs> Thank you, sweetheart. Oh, is it Corey's on catch up? <laughs> Don't blame you. <laughs> Don't blame you. Take care, Zoe. Catch you in the next one. Yep, it's going to be great. It's going to be great. She is childish. Yeah. You guys hate me more now, don't you? Yes, 100%. So, ooh, ooh. Yes, we, we can't stand you. <sighs> And do you know what? If you end up homeless, Chantel, you know, like if the, you know, like the cats where we're unsure where they're being homed, if they're being homed, and and the viewers of you have genuine concern whether they love you or they hate you. They have got one thing in common here: genuine concern for those cats being placed in a safe place. Um, do you know, if the boot was on the other foot and this was you about to be homeless. Do you know what? None of us would give a crap. We'd all be going, serves you right. Yeah, bought on herself. What an idiot. Smug tail is back. <laughs> no, seriously. Is that what it says at the end? I didn't read it all. Oh, she hasn't put another one up, has she? What? 
Wow. Ah, uh, now she's raging at French fry girl again now. I don't know what's been going on. <clears throat> Difficult to keep up with the lunacy. All Ella did was expose how much of a creep he was. It's true, babe. Yeah, I just see that so one. funny, cutie pie. You're a cutie pie. No, you're yes, yeah, that's such a good Muslim lady. Full of decorum. Cute humility. Cutie pie. <laughs> And why, just because Sala is a younger man, does everyone assume he actually wants children in a parenting life? Perhaps he wants to travel and... Uh, because Foodie told us he wanted kids. And she was talking about adoption. Oh, no, she was actually talking about a womb transplant. <laughs> yeah, of all the worthy people for that, you wouldn't be a candidate for it, Foodie. You're too old. You're too fat. You're too unhealthy. You're too disgusting. So you told us that. I don't have kids, it's normal nowadays. <clears throat> well, right now, at this point in our life, that's what we will do. And, you know, if God wants that, like, inshallah for everything that well, happens in our life, God, God wants us to do it, it will happen. But you can't have children. You've had a hysterectomy. There's no second coming of Christ. Not with you. You know, though, funny thought, I used to think, I know this is haram to talk about, like, psychics and things, but... Well, it's no different than having a tattoo of a zodiac on your arm, is it? You know? It is. She gets away with all the terms of service, though, doesn't she? She does. Yeah, she says she's going to pop her. What's she actually say here? Let's go and have a look. You and Peter Griffin want to be, I love God, so forgive me for this, but shouting if you ever talk about my mama again i will take a charge and pop you one right in the fat slimy smoky hole of yours french fried goblin <clears throat> yeah that's a threat threat of violence oh we're on 9.3.8 subs dropping dropping nicely don't forget to unsub ladies <laughs> oh no that's against terms of service don't forget to keep subbed <laughs> Whenever <laughs> I keep always thinking about what that psychic I'm not putting that up in Ola, that's horrible. Told me years and years ago when I was with Pete actually and I could never believe like I was able like you know, the whole children thing wasn't an issue and then after my hysterectomy mm -hmm. I kept thinking back to that. Oh I guess that psychic is wrong. But Yeah, she is a hundred percent psychopath. Not necessarily. You never know. <laughs> I what? What do you mean we'll never know? You've had a hysterectomy. Now, I'm not infertility shaming you or anything like that. But, no, you're not. The psychic was incorrect. Unless they said you're going to go to some very poor country in the middle of nowhere, exploit the people and buy some children and forge documents and get caught at the airport. Like, did she say that? Because just no, that's not going to happen. And that's not infertility shaming you. You've got years and years of weight to lose. Then there's all the surgery from all the fat, like the skin will be hanging off of you and all the recovery from that. And then you'll be too old. Please. I never thought I would be a married housewife. Like what? You're not married. And you're not, look at the state of your house. Come on, please. Mm -hmm. Flirt, flirting tip. On a dark desert highway. She really Getting... an idiot. I mean, she keeps doing these things. And, you, you know, it's, it's bad enough, like, um, <clears throat> gaslighting her audience with the cats like she is and everything else. But, I mean, that's, that's just that's just there. She's done it again. Um mm. Yeah, she's so stupid. So so stupid. Had, yeah, well I had a lot of Well, it'd be funny if the cats are rehomed and she isn't, wouldn't it? <laughs> wouldn't it be good if the cats actually have got a home and like foodie gets another TOS strike? <laughs> mm. 
Yes, all them times she's um, called people hillbillies and living in trailers and all the rest of it. Um, foodie skipped a payday. She wouldn't even be able to afford a trailer, would she? Hmm, that would be a shame. Nice time with Sam yesterday, okay? <laughs> You're so embarrassed for me. Have any of you seen the movie Not Without My Daughter? It's that how many women are abused and how captive in situation. Oh my god, <laughs> that one movie. So when Chantal goes back to see... I don't know if that was a reference to, towards violence against women in the Middle East, but it's absolutely rife. I've uh, seen it firsthand over there. Um, not saying it's not rife everywhere, but it... Um, hmm. Middle East, I can safely say I've never seen it on an accepted mass scale like that. Violence all round, to be fair. Salah and Kui, are y'all going to say that Missy Mutu? <laughs> yeah, oh, really. they will do. They I will can't do. Believe... Oh, God, Jade, you've only been you've only been with Chantel five days. Help yourself now. Get out, Jade. <laughs> Get out. We've been here six years. <laughs> Oh, oh, you poor thing, Jade. I feel terrible. Get out now. Run. Hi, Blondie. How are you feeling, sweet? Listening while adulting. Oh, man, that sucks, doesn't it? I've been adulting all day at work today, just winding down with this. Well, winding myself up with this and picking my fingers like no one's business over these cats. <clears throat> Mm, she is. She is pushing her luck. She really is. Because people hate her, so they'll have mass flagged that. <laughs> I can't believe he would want her back. What? You don't know anything about how we spent time together. <laughs> she is something, isn't it? It's not, not normal. No, it's weird. She hasn't eaten. Any sense of that? Anyone at all? No. Okay, moving on. <laughs> Please cure you. Sol is missing. <laughs> oh, we'll have to neutralise it. We'll have a bit of Kay's cooking or some other rando weirdos. Um, no, we could check in with King Cobra tomorrow, see what he's been up to. I mean, he's nowhere near as bad as Foodie, but pretty rank. You love that movie? I find that movie was like unrealistic in a lot of ways mm -hmm. what about all the what about aladdin what about that movie <laughs> can i come to kuwait with you guys on board sure reading that hurt my brain <laughs> Chantel Stan. <laughs> oh my God, your picture. <laughs> can we see sam oh yes. god yes Oh, this is horrible. No, don't. I'm going to cry if she puts the cat. After a certain age. Is she going to put the cat on the camera? Oh. Isn't it harder to adopt? Oh. You're nearly 40, but I have a serious discussion. Like I said, God wants it. It will happen. Well, it won't then. But I don't think so. <laughs> My daughter is so sick, not sure if it's food poisoning or what. It was a rough night. Oh no! Blocks chaos. Something from the Super Bowl spread. I'm just kidding. No, I seriously, I'm seriously hoping that she'll feel better. Sorry to hear that. Oh my God! Look at the fake <laughs> concern here. Honestly, please. <clears throat> like just vomiting. No, that's the worst. Sam will still be ha have a happy life. At least he will not die like FFG did when she had killed her two dogs in a year. And she's still harassing you in her dirty live streams. I know, like, what is the story with her dog? No, honestly, like, yeah, I'm coming for your dog's B. What are you going to do about it? Yeah, we've got, there's quite a few Cobes um, <coughs> videos up on here from over over the years, over the last few years. All right, we'll have a Cobe stream. We'll, we'll do a Cobe stream. Not tonight, because I've got to, got to go to work tomorrow. Um, well, got to get up, walk downstairs and work from home tomorrow. But, but um. All right, we'll have a bit of cobes. We'll like we'll we'll neutralise this horror with a bit of cobes and yeah. Well, there, there's other randos on the internet that we can always go and have a nose at. I've been over on TikTok. Um, that that's there, there's all the woke people over there. I'm like, oh my god, 
<laughs> to, to all the woke people. <laughs> well, is that, what? What's going on here? What are they talking about? There's a rock weirdos on TikTok. <laughs> Show up. Like, what are you going to do? I'm not coming for your dogs. I'm coming for your crappy ownership because you have the nerve to make live streams about how I take, how I'm giving, rehoming my pets, which is the best thing for them in their interest. How about you open that cracked skull of yours and think for a little while? Like, seriously, like, what is her problem? Like, what happened to her dogs? Uh, there's so many stories, okay? Stop Allegedly, it. her second dog died. Stop it, Chantel. Why are you doing this? Jesus of of grief from the other dog right okay really. we're gonna have to do a history of cobes because what cobes is now is not what what it was like at the beginning a bit like chantel what Chant i mean chantel's always been a pos but um like cobes wasn't like he is now we'll take it right back to when he used to go on his little bike and he used to cycle to his job at wendy's when he used to try and dye his hair and turn himself blue and stuff like that. We'll take it right back to original Cobes and we'll start from the beginning and we'll work through. <clears throat> well, yeah, Clo Cobes actually is more palatable every day of the week than Chantel is. I've not seen that. I haven't, I haven't checked in with Cobes for a little while. <laughs> I've not checked in with him. But, um, yeah, the Wendy's days. You've never heard of Cobes. Oh, dear. Okay. We'll have to. We'll have to. Yeah, Cobes is great. I love Cobes. <laughs> Cobes and the sex doll. Cobes and the ventriloquist dummy. Cobes and the glitter bombs. Cobes and the tear dye. Uh, Cobes and the nail varnish. <laughs> There's been so many. <laughs> Cobes and his wondrous cooking. All right, we'll have to go. We'll have to go because um, Cobes is actually better than foodie. Really, doesn't sound sketchy at all. What happened to Dragon Lord Frodo? Did he end up in prison, or is he just been yeeted again off of YouTube? I've not heard of uh, anything from Dra Dragon Lord Frodo for quite a while. But meanwhile, I have to rehome my pets, which is in their best interest, instead of lugging them to another country in a smaller apartment. Like, what? Where, when I'm going to be traveling and living life, you should try it. It's so true. I'm sorry, but... You're right, Effie. Yeah, animals can die of a broken heart. You hear of it quite often, don't you? Like, if um, you've got, like, two dogs together and one dies and then very shortly after the other one goes. Um, because they're just, they're companions. Happens with people as well, doesn't it? Happens with people. Well, it's Valentine's drink. Okay, we'll have to have a look at that. <laughs> I've been sleeping like no one's business. I've been I like I just sleep all the time at the moment. I've done well, I'm still awake. But then I have had about five cups of coffee today during work, so that would probably be the reason for that. Yeah, exactly. So the, they were just judging that the, these pets are abused and live in horrible conditions, even though the the uh, animal control showed up like three times since living here. No, Dragon Lord Frodo, yeah, Dragon Lord Frodo was the one with the little trike, um, but no, Cobes is someone else. Cobes is someone else. I can't remember what colour Cobes' bike was, but you don't ever see him on it anymore. Yeah, I, I don't know what happened to dear Dragon Lord Frodo, but his audio was always terrible in his streams, and he'd let his bollocks hang out of his pants, wouldn't he? So he was always a bit like, oh no, Let's be, you'd have to watch all of it beforehand, and then once you watched it all, you're like, man, I can't put myself through that again. <laughs> and, like, oh my gosh, hello. Yeah, Kay is really better. Stop with Kay's she's not car there. crash, is she? Well, then, how about you keep that energy, Brittany, with her and go tell her to shut up about my cats? How about that? That's the only reason we're bringing up her dead dogs is because... And how do you know she loved them? Like, how do you know? No, I get you. 
I get you 100%. I mean, I'll still be here for when it all goes horribly wrong, which looks like it's just around the corner for her. Um, but yeah, I think we do need to um, less foodie, more everyone else. There's loads of different weirdos on the internet, um, but that it, it's not as dark as this. <clears throat> Yeah, it is getting dark. You're right. You're right. It's, it's just getting like, it's actually getting quite upsetting what she's done with the cats. There's no coming back from it. And none of us will forgive her. None of us will ever see her in the same light again. Um, not that we were seeing her in a great light anyway, but this is pretty much nailed it for me. Well, I'll keep on, we'll, we'll still keep watching when she's an idiot and stuff like that. But as far as this channel goes, we will, unless it gets good like it gets bad for her um then we'll we'll start putting different people up on here because the internet's full of them there's a weirdo out there for everything god i was even watching a bit of uni cult the other day going christ they're just batshit <laughs> they're still mental not checked in with uni cult for quite a while good year and a half <laughs> so there are there's a schmuggers board out there of <laughs> weirdos <laughs> doesn't have to be all chantel uh, I think she's had the Chantel shit show for far too long. And, uh, yeah, we'll start reducing her, reducing the uh, volume of content <clears throat> that we cover with her. She's claiming I don't love my cat. So why is it so far-fetched for us to assume she didn't love her dogs? Like, go keep that energy with her. Thank you. Address it. <laughs> Welcome to Rembrandt Media Recent Views. <laughs> like seriously yep F and Brittany, i'm giving a response for that racist witch called ffg exactly oh yeah there's the girlfriend there's a couple of girlfriend sagas if you go right back to the beginning with cobes there's girlfriends there's um the bloke the weirdo bloke that lived on his couch for a while um very in run-ins with his dad <laughs> trying to get him to get a job there's the tactical soap where he gets in the shower and makes a little advert for tactical soap. That's a good one. <laughs> yeah, that that's true. That is true. Is she over on Rumble now, or did she get her channel back? I haven't quit. I haven't kept up with DC. I mean, there's so many you can't keep up with them all. I do quite a good job at keeping up with them, but not all of them. Is she is she is she over on Rumble or is she back on YouTube? Actually, I can go and have a look, can't I? Yeah, Cobes and the blow up doll that he burst. That was good. <laughs> Let's see, is DC back? DC Media Girl. Let's have a look. Oh, it doesn't look like it. Nope. No, it doesn't look like she is back. God, what happened to her? She's on... Uh, <laughs> the tactical soap was the best. Lee's going to get a new stepdad soon. Excellent. <laughs> yeah, that was Christmas. That was Christmas. He got he got chucked in the drunk tank. Yeah, that was Christmas. <laughs> She's on Rumble. I uh, thought she would be. Yeah, of course. I don't. Know. That's a weird old setup, that isn't it? All right, bit of DC from now. All right. Uh, yeah, we'll just start doing different weirdos on the internet. It doesn't all have to be Chantel because she's vile and she shouldn't be earning money off of it, should she, really? That's all we're doing is responding to what she does exactly to us. <laughs> <clears throat> the cat situation is sad and unfortunate, but these people who... The, the, in, uh, the, the only thing that bothers me is Negs can be a real vindictive thing. Um, and... You kind of go in on, you sort of start embarking on him and you're potentially walking into something that, you, that nobody needs, if you get what get what I mean. Um, I don't know, I don't know, because they, they can be nasty, he can be nasty, and he'll keep, he'll keep 
shite going for years and years and years and years. And I'm not really up for that, to be honest. It feels it. I know. Obviously, it's sad, but it's like, what do you, mean? you know. Wow, she I get that. Obviously, it's sad. <laughs> but, like, life is always moving on. Like, I'm not, I don't know. I don't feel, I feel sad that I'm not going to have them. But at the same time. Okay, we'll do that. All right, there you go. But we'll keep an eye on her. I will keep an eye on her. Um. Yeah, Cope says Sean. Yeah, I've never known if it's Sean with you or E A N. I don't know. But yeah, he's got Sean there. Sean the ventriloquist dummy that he actually packed up about a year or so ago and got him all redone. Sent him away, he did. Um, and he got him all repainted and spruced up again. And he does look much better for it after his makeover. Hmm. I guess I'm mature. Oh my god, how do I know these things? Oh no, this is such a bad reflection of me. This all started when I was overseas and basically I only had my laptop and YouTube for anything that I could understand. Um, so I was basically on YouTube and you know you have the autoplay and before you know it you're in places you never thought you'd ever be and you're like, hey, I started off watching a documentary on North Korea. I've woke up at three in the morning. Who's this fat chick? <laughs> Woof. And then you're in. And then you start watching that one. You get Anne Boleyn. Then you get bloody King Cobra. Then you get Dragon Lord Frodo. Then you get Hungry Fat Chick and Amy's life journey. And it always oh, just spiralled. <sighs> I've been stuck here for years now or I have with these people. <laughs> enough to realise that this is a situation that has to happen. You know? It is sometimes the best thing you can do. Um... Exactly. That's what worries me about pushing buttons on him. He's not. Jude, fun. I wouldn't it's rehome nasty. my children, okay? Frank, <laughs> you should board the cats for the three months you are gone. I'm going to be gone for more than three months, inshallah. That's why I'm doing Do this. It. I'm not just, it's not like I'm coming. Do it. It's great fun. It is great fun. Do a bit of retro on all of them. Back to <laughs> home for no. these cats. And what has not. There's no hope for you now. You've been here too long, Blue Star. There's no getting out for you. The only person in this chat that has a chance is... Who was it? Hang on. Can't find her on the chat. She might have ran away. Might have escaped. Jade Fox is the only one that there is any hope of escape. Only one week in. Not even one week in. That's how it happens, isn't it? Oh, did he? A <laughs> Boglim Chronicles as well does does good, and um, King Cobra Bite Size not so much anymore. Doesn't put as much up, but um, done some really good old documentaries. Maybe we should do that. When we'll have an evening of one of the Cobe early days documentaries. Yeah, it is the algorithm. Yeah, ruined by the algorithm. Fair for them, you know. It's not fair. Katrina Mary Reyes, welcome to Van Promise Recipes. It's not fair for them, you know. So, uh, <laughs> yay! Yes, welcome back, Katrina. Yes. If Sorry, Jay. Fair, it also <laughs> depends on the individual cat. I had four. The oldest would have died without me. So as weird as it may sound, when I become allergic, I was glad she'd already passed. Yeah. Is that how it works in Canada? You lose your health insurance. Blimey. Mind you, she don't deserve her health insurance anyway. She shouldn't pay her taxes. <sighs> Not at you, Effie. It's just like when I think about it, it's like, oh no, she's going to lose her health insurance. She shouldn't have it in the first place. She's not paying her tax. Yeah. <clears throat> I think Sam... Maybe one of those cats that just will, will be really sad without me because we have a bond. Oh my god, how dare you speak like this when you're just casting him aside like a prop that's no longer required for your horrific YouTube channel. Oh god. But at the same time, I think 
with somebody that's a similar personality as me, mm -hmm. which it is, that, like, in a way, actually more nurturing, <laughs> not as hyper. Hyper? The state of your house? What do you mean, hyper? Cracked out your head, do you mean? A one-woman goddamn wrecking ball? Destroyer of friendships? Like, just shut up. Like, anybody, actually, who cares about animals is better than you. He will be better with them than you. He didn't even want a bar of you when you first came back. So he was over you in the time you were away. It was BBJ who wasn't. Sam didn't give a crap. I'm tired of hearing about the cats. It's the best situation. Would you rather her not be with her husband? They couldn't make a trip like that. They, even if they did that place is small. Exactly. No, you're not blocked. Putin, I know you have a problem with my weight. But you're oh, the only okay. one who does. I don't have one. So, Ooh. yeah, I'm going to travel adding 100 kg. That's my problem. Oh, well. What are you mad that I can? Yeah, <laughs> you it can't is. At your skinny weight. It is. That, that's why, I mean, you can't look away at it. When you think, right, okay, these things have got to get better from here on. They get worse. And then you think, right, well, she can't match and raise this. It gets worse. And worse. And worse. I mean... You kind of thought the snow habit and the OnlyFans was pretty much the pinnacle of how bad this could all get. That wasn't even scratching the surface. That was like the good old days now, compared with where we are. It's just ludicrous. And and that's the thing. You can't stop watching it. I mean, we can stop covering it all the goddamn time on this channel. That's for sure. I've heard you. We don't need it. We'll keep an eye on it, but we don't need it. We'll catch in with her a couple of times a week, if that. Um, or we'll pick the worst of the week over a weekend and the rest of it. Then if I do any lives during the week, like one or two during the week, then we'll do other people. That came out wrong. We'll cover other people. We'll do other people. We will over it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, but, um, yeah, it is that. I want to see where this all ends up. It's, some people are thin and don't travel. Know, Who cares? Right? You think I'm going to let my weight, like, hold me back from doing things I really want to do? Mm -hmm. Nothing holds me back from oh things I Oh, my God, really have you want. seen what Shani's been up to the last couple of weeks? That's quite something. We need to go and check in over there with that nut job as well. Nothing. Too many nut jobs. It Only one channel. Yeah, it is hard. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's weird, is isn't it? Is bothered? Well, seem, but I am. Um, this whole conversation is ridiculous. They didn't think you were a good pet owner and now you're rehoming them and that's wrong. Make up your mind, people, for fuck's sake. Exactly. <clears throat> yeah, he seems to be dependent on me, but he'll have a new owner to be dependent on. And he'll be happier, I think, in the long run. That's for the most it. Trust amazing me, if he thing could out of all of it. Face... That is the most amazing thing out of all of it. Somehow, she gets worse. Like, <laughs> and it, it it just it beggars belief. It absolutely beggars belief. But she she does. She she can lower the bar. Um, when you think it's on the pavement, it starts embedding itself in the ground. It goes lower. Well, yeah, there there is that. Now I wouldn't wish anyone like you know bad bad, but she could do with a little bit of a wake up call here. I'm sure he would too. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. I've traveled internationally many times and it's stressful and not fun. I can't imagine putting a cat through that when they can just go live in a stable home. The fuck? Yeah, exactly. I get you. Right. For sure. I think she's actually sucked the energy out of everyone at this point. Um, I can see everybody taking a little step back from her. This channel will. We'll keep an eye on her from, uh, from a bit of a distance, or I will. And if she does anything really stupid that actually might be mildly entertaining, we'll revisit. But I think after this, um, what she's doing with the cats, we'll say goodbye to BBJ when that happens. She hasn't said. Um, and then that'll be the end of it for a while for, for, for this channel, I think. She's sucking the lifeblood out of all of us. Um, and we're all getting a bit 
fed up of it. So there's nothing wrong with having a break from her. Sure. Yeah, blocks chaos, exactly. <laughs> I just need something. I work in the vet field and I've seen so many things that could be prevented and are not, but I think this is a responsible choice. Some people drop off cats in random places. Yeah, I could never do that. No, no, they're going to be taken care of. Mm -hmm. Surely well. Save I know it's that. sad, but it's just like, you know, <clears throat> unfortunately, just it is what it is. She is. She's like an energy vampire, isn't she? But I think she's actually worn us all out now. <clears throat> Being smug about what? <laughs> like, I repent for what? I can see everyone in chat, but I am also glazing and talk to text while cooking. I'm well, she a busy should woman, be. Man. Oh, <laughs> what are you making? I mean, she should be scared. This is her only means of earning any money. She, do you think she's employable anywhere in Canada? Other than, like, I don't know, a cam girl for fat people. But there's loads of them out there that are hard-working cam girls, like fat cam girls. And they put the hours in, they build their audience and all of that. Um, she won't do that. She's used to being able to just get hugs off of the internet. Um, she didn't bother building up Twitch. She didn't bother building up anything else. Um, so she, she'd be stuck. And she should be scared because she's unemployable. What transferable skills has this given her? She could have had merch. She could have all these things. And she's probably thinking... All, all she was thinking of, the one that I watched this morning a bit of, was getting another YouTube channel. So just thinking about rinsing people again for another load of memberships. Not going to work. Not going to work, foodie. People are bored of you. I'm hungry. Maybe Jay's new mom. I love this app. Stop it, Chantel. Just stop playing games with this. I know you'd be conscious of the time, so you'd know it was coming up to call to prayer. Um, call to prayer never made me jump. Because you know what time of day it is. Idiot. Look at her. She knows she's doing this. She knows she's playing games with this. Because it alerts you. Okay. I gotta go. I'm gonna go do prayer before my mom comes. Bullshit. Okay, so you're gonna go and do prayer before your mum comes, but yet you took a picture, you took a photo of you in the car with the cat without your mum. Make that make any sense at all? <clears throat> it always is. She's like a cockroach. She'd survive the whole the nuclear holocaust. This one would. Oh, is this one? Wild soaps on the web. Okie doke. <laughs> Here we go. I shall go into that and sub myself when I come out of stream yards. <laughs> she's, oh, God. Now she's going to make it. So, so how did that work? How did that work? Her mum's coming round and then she takes a picture of her and the cat in the car because he escapes out of the cat box. Where's the mother then? Let's go back to that picture. Ah, DC Media Girl. <laughs> ah, it's not safe on the tubes anymore. <laughs> right, where are we? Oh no, that's me. <laughs> right, okay. Right, do we think our mum's sitting next to her? Difficult to tell. Doesn't look like it to me. Doesn't look like it to me. Weird. Probably more lies. Probably more lies. Mm-hmm. Yep. Right, looks like she's finished. Thank God. Yeah. 
So you guys too. Sorry guys. I have to have it on. <laughs> All right, guys. It's time to pray. Thank you guys. And <laughs> Oh, you miserable bitch. She said that she was gonna let everyone say goodbye to Sam and she didn't. Oh, you horror. I'm starting to learn like some of the lines by heart now. Yeah, yeah. Imagine that going off in the southern parrot fashion. No meaning behind them as far as you're concerned, right? In place. No. All right, I'll see you guys after, okay? <laughs> Bye. No, best day ever. Foodie having her best day ever, getting rid of her cat. What a pig. Oh. <clears throat> I know any any of the rest of us would have been, you know, would have would have just been like in so much bother by now if we'd have pulled like a tenth of what foodie pulls. But I'll oh know the nuclear cockroach. She'll be there surviving. I know, right? She didn't didn't even bother, did she? Didn't even bother to put him on camera. She's really horrible, really really horrible. I haven't grabbed the picture, I'm afraid. I haven't copied it. But it's over on a community post, um, Blue Star, along with all the other abuse that seems to have popped up there. Nothing like keeping the attention on your cat. We just got stupidness with French fried girl. And, um, yeah, stay mad, babies. Oh, look, the last line, she's rewriting, stay mad, baby. Oh, God. She didn't love her pets. Blah, blah, blah. I put in 18 years. Stay mad, babies. You sicko. What the hell is wrong with her? Nice. Ridiculous. Sorry, I just got myself reading our stupid comments from a stupid fandom. Ugh. <laughs> well, can you wait for the open house? I mean, someone will go round there and film it. There's no, there's no way she's put it on their version of Craigslist over there, isn't she? So, I mean, that's going to be coming up unless it's well no, That listing is definitely there. Um, but oh, excuse me, I'm getting a bit tired. See, look, this is well past my bedtime. I've been in bed at like eight o'clock every day for the last two weeks on. Seven minutes past ten at night. Goodness me, this is almost like night clubbing. <laughs> right. Yeah, exactly. I I done eighteen years. You lucky, lucky that any you know any any one of us to have have animals that that live live that long or choose to stay with us that long. All right, her cats were more like hostages because they weren't allowed out or anything. Um, would they have chose to rehome themselves? Quite possibly. Cats tend to do that. Um, but, you know, any animal that gives you pretty much its whole life doesn't deserve this, does it? Doesn't deserve this. That's really upset me. Um, right, but I'm actually giving Foodie Beauty what she wants because that's what she's trying to do. She's trying to upset all of her viewers and reaction channels um, by using her cats to do that. And it's working because we're not POSs like she is. Um, I don't think she'll come back from this one in longevity. I think this might be the final hurrah. Um, get back over to QA as quick as you can, Foodie, and make this all just like fizzle out. Good luck to you. You're going to need it. Right, anyway, on that chirpy note, <laughs> there's me being a vexed, nasty thing. Um, right, have a super evening. Um, look after yourselves. And um, I don't know, depending on how I feel, I've got that blooming doctor's appointment tomorrow afternoon to see what bad news or good news they give me. I don't know why I'm being pessimistic. She's put me in a mood like that with cats. Um, probably will be good news. Let's go with that. 
but depending on how I feel after whatever they tell me tomorrow um, from those latest tests, then um, will he be on a live and we'll do a bit of retro cobes or something like that? Um, or I'll try and catch you on Wednesday, Wednesday or Thursday. But we'll see how we go. All righty. Right. Have a super evening. Night, night. Um, or good morning or good afternoon or good evening, wherever you are. Thank you very much, Enola. Thank you. That's very kind. Oh, you're more than welcome, Jade. <laughs> you keep. Oh, it's not. It's not cold up in Scotland today, is it? So you you um, you have a nice relaxed evening. Right. That's it. I'm out of here. I'm going to bed. <laughs> God, I'm up so late. It's like being a proper grown up. Right. That's it. I'm out. Look after yourselves. Take care. Hopefully, catch you tomorrow. All right. Bye bye. Bye. <laughs>